Yo, dudes, oh my lord. Bro, the timing is a scam. Chapter I swear, yeah, that right, the timing is a scam. What's up, guys? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the restream, the watch along. How y'all doing? All right, no, 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 no. I, I have, I, I can explain myself, all right? I was at my friend's place. By the way, I'm not in Philippines, by the way. Everybody thinks I'm in Philippines, but I'm not in Philippines. I'm still at home. So everybody who thought I was going to be in the Philippines, I'm sorry. I'm not in the Philippines, unfortunately. But here, all right? No, no, this is, this is bullshit. I was following the schedule of what was laid out in MPLPH official website, okay? Here, I'll, I'll fucking show you guys. I'll show you guys, okay? Chop the roof and let the smoke so here, Look. It says 5 p.m. So this is 5 p.m. GMT plus 8. Should be 5 p.m. Philippines time, right? So it should be 4 p.m. my time. So I got back home at 4 p.m. And when I opened the fucking stream, it was already 10 minutes in. Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck, man? Like, that's not my fault, bro. How? That's not my fault. That's not my fault, by the way. Like, that's not my fault at all. Chop okay? the roof and no. let the smoke no. clear. I, no. <laughs> I was trying to follow the schedule. I thought it was going to be on time. Turns out, it's not on time. All right, whatever. It's 5.12 here. Yeah, but the game has been played already. Like, it's it, the game at 5, at 4, at 5 p.m., it was already 10 minutes in. I joined, like, I literally clicked on it, and I was like, you know what? Fuck it, I'll just watch it before, and then I'll just start it when the game ends so we can actually, like, actually, like, continue. One zero AP Brent, guys. So far, Grand Finals, mere bless. Uh, my prediction was um, AP Bren for champion. Your transition music is louder than your mic. I'm sorry, man. I have to like work on that. I don't know how to turn the audio down on that. Wait. Properties. Yeah, I don't know how to change the audio. I'm gonna have to like. I think I, I wait. Let me just advanced audio properties. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I'll try to change it some other time, man, but... Yeah. Game one, guys. Pick Onyx Indo to win M5 to give them to your, your curse. I break that AP Brent to be champ, so if um, if uh, if AP Brent becomes champ here, and then Onyx becomes champ in MPLID, and then I predict Onyx to become champ, then they'll be champ, no? <laughs> Join Beloy and Coach Yeb. They're speaking Indo, guys. I'm afraid I'll, like, disturb their restream. Wait, let me check their restream. Let me check if they're act if you're if you're speaking Indo or English. Because they're speaking English, let's go. Are they speaking English? No, they're speaking Indo. Volume up, can't hear you? That's bullshit. No way. Is my volume actually low? No way. Is it low? No, it's not low. Is it low? Is it actually low? I've never had that co comment before. Like, my audio is low. Never. What's your prediction on the wild card? We'll see what happens in the wild card first before we actually, like, make predictions. We'll okay. Some people are saying it's low. Some people are saying it's not. What the heck? Audio all good. All right. I'll trust the guys who are saying all good. Respect this man for reaching me in the PH venue and using AI-generated background just for his room. Just for us. <laughs> Mirko, cast the curse on Echo and Brigida enhance it. <laughs> Did Brigida predict the Echo as well? In PH, it's either I'll start early or I'll start late. There's no exact time. Yeah, I've, I've noticed. <laughs> I have noticed. My goodness. No, I was not at SOD last night. I don't enjoy, like, going out, like, to, to those kind of parties. I don't know. Hope to see Edward Bene or pa Paquito today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. I want to see all the... Can Bosco beat RQ? Yes. I think Bosco are the favorites coming into the MDL Grand Finals. Pick something in your background. Pick something in my background. You, you... Do you guys... Okay. Do you guys actually think my background's fake? Do you guys actually think this is AI generated? When is wildcard group draw? I have no idea. No idea. No no info yet. Watch winning moment of Echo vs. RSG game 4 in Tagalog stream. Brigida announced that Echo is going to M5. 
dude, this is not a fake background, bro. I can literally pick anything I want here. Um, it's not a green screen, brothers. It's not a green screen. I'm not in. I'm not in Philippines, guys. I'm at home. <laughs> Did you watch game one? Your thoughts? Uh, yeah. I actually watched game one just to have, like, when AP Brent already had, like, a 7,000 gold lead, though. By the way, fully, full stadium, dude. Full, full arena. Look at this shit. Chapter Yo, who's been let the smoke That's play. lit. Look at that. Look at the audience, man. That looks lit, actually. What are the opportunities for Malaysian SMG on the wildcard M5? I think SMG are favorites coming into it. If SMG lose, it'll be very weird. By the way, congratulations to Mara and Leo. Can we get a W Mara and W Leo in the chat for best Filipino talent and best English talent, my dudes? W Leo, W Mara. Let's get that. Let's get that in Chapter the chat. Go on. Let the smoke w, Leo, clear. w Mara. W. Congratulations to Mara and Leo for winning. Can't wait to be can't wait to work with you guys again. What what is why is it like this? Here, so I so you guys can see what's going on. Oh, whoops. Oh, 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 professional streamer. <laughs> what the fuck? Where is the, the, the thing? There you go. Let's make it smaller. Let's put it to the side so you guys can see exactly what's going on. So we know that we're in break. All right, there you go. Hey, Mirko. Mara is always a W for sure. Mara and Leo are always W, bro. They're, by the way, Mirko, I think they're watching your stream. They put mic on the audience. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that's also like, well, the talents definitely gave um, production some tips and advice as well to to put the mic in the audience and stuff it's not me i think mainly it's the the talents over there because it's something that me lafell and leo and technically all the talents we we, we like to complain a lot because we, we want the show to be as good as it is right so yeah the more bitchy the talent is the better the, the show is going to be technically because we will all be very like bitchy about what what should be done and stuff because even in m4 we weren't able to hear the audience for the first few days uh, in the, the big stadium and we were like dude if we don't put some mics in it's gonna be a waste and then they, they did it and then uh, same goes for MPLID first day for some reason first day they just never have the 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 right things the, the, I mean like the, the microphones in, in, in the audience which is crucial in my opinion so every time I just have to say yo remember audience mic audience mic Who are you cursing today? No cursing today, boys. Just gonna go through with the prediction. My prediction uh, for MPLPH was AP Brand Grand Finals through upper brackets and AP Brand win. And so far, AP Brand through Grand Finals and AP Brand 1-0. We'll see if Blacklist can go up. Um, looking at it, though, I don't know. Blacklist, it feels like Blacklist are really strong. Don't get me wrong. But AP Brand, this meta is just made for them, I feel. That's why I rated them so high in my prediction video. Hello, Mirko. What's up, my guy? I'm just rooting for the team who's losing. I want seven games. I would love seven games, but I think it's very unlikely to see seven games. Unless, like, unless somehow AP Brand just fumbles. Because I feel they have they have all it needs to to just, like, yeah, go in. Yaoi out? Yeah, they won with Yaoi, though. What's the thing with the red side and blue side? Would you explain, like, the advantages and disadvantages? Well, here. Let's take a look at the draft. Technically, it's not really like an advantage. Both both sides have advantages, but right now, I mean, it really depends on preference. Here, if we go on to here, I'll explain to you why a lot of players or not players, but a lot of coaches. I don't know if this is like exactly what, exactly the reason as to why they they like red side more, but here, 
Red side, you get two picks in the first phase. Like, so basically, AP Brennan gets, like, blue side gets one pick, and then this, you get two to respond one, and then to take another prio pick. And then you get to last pick in the first phase. So you get to counter one of these heroes as well. So technically, you get two chance of counters against the first, uh, against blue side. And then in the second phase, the second phase, I think, is the, is the game changer. Because you get first pick in the second phase and last pick in the second phase, right? After... So you can basically, let's say they pick everything except for gold lane, right? They leave gold lane here. And then AP Brand do the same thing. Gold lane still left open. So gold lane is going to be, be, be contested. They're going to ban gold lanes here. And then they can first pick one of the gold lanes. Let's say they ban Irithel and they ban um, Brody. And they set up for a Claude. Or just they ban a, a counters and then they de deny a hero from uh, the enemy gold lane. So first pick here. And then they also got the chance to last pick. So they can flex one of the picks that they set up in the first phase. So it's like, you get so many advantages there. That's why I think red side is more prior right now. That's why a lot of teams have been going for red side more. But again, it's pro it's it's literally preference because it's not like blue side has no advantages either. It's blue side, you get a uh, prior pick easier because it's first pick. You get to basically bait out a lot of um, bands from red side, like Nolan, Joy, Fanny. I think those three bands will always be banned out from uh, from blue side. And, well, especially if you have the user on it, like a, a Joy user, um, a, a Fanny user, or a Nolan user. How crazy it can be if Yaoi will play in Indonesia next season. Can't imagine how Eternal will react. Dude, if if Yaoi... Yo, thank you so much, Sarek. Much appreciated, much appreciate my guy. Thank you so much for the donation, or for the membership. Welcome to the Alpha Squad. See, my guy. Um, join the Discord and a request for your role, because you get an Alpha role. You get a higher chance to play with me. Uh, but yeah, Snipe Gaming. Dude, if Yaoi comes to Indo, the number one threat to Yaoi will not be the teams of MPL Indo, but it will be Eterna. I swear to God. Like... Yaoi will not be able to walk anywhere near the talent room or anywhere outside of his uh, own, like, player room because Eterna will ask for a picture every single day. If Yaoi comes to, to Aura or to Indo, bro, Yaoi, good luck, my guy. Fangirl Eterna is, is scary. <laughs> the, the real miracle is in the Philippines. Why no restream Echo versus Blacklist? Because yesterday I was out. Uh, I was casting MDL. So, yeah. Unfortunate. Check their jacket. Dude, dude, I want the AP brand jacket. I actually asked, like... So, someone from Moonton is in, in PH right now. Someone who's in Moonton... Who's working for Moonton ID. Who's, like, par a part of Moonton ID. Is Went to the Philippines, right? Is, is in Philippines right now for MPL PH. And I was like, dude, get me an AP brand varsity. Apparently, it's pre-orders only. So, it's like, fuck... So sad. And apparently, I wanted to get a jersey if it wasn't, like, a, a jacket. And the jacket, they, they only have XL. All the other sizes have been sold out, apparently. That is so sad, bro. Oh, but we're getting into drafts. Okay, drafts, 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 drafts. My dudes, it's a drafting Drop time. The roof and let the smoke clear. Come here for the M5 World Championship. Let's go. go. Over to Pasai, play some MLB okay, blue side, black was this time. All right, so black has chose blue side. So, America, what can you say about the Let's Echo? They entered here, Yaoi game four, they won, won but should Yaoi have... Uh, at the lead, yeah, I feel like Yaoi entered a bit too late. I think the the, the, the better kind of swap that they were supposed to do should be in the, in the upper brackets, kind of like uh, Marky. If Marky was swapped into lower brackets, I wouldn't like that, you know? Like, let's say Chidera played in the upper brackets and they lost to RQ, and then they played in the lower brackets and Chidera was still underperforming. It's 2-0 down, and then they swap Marky. In lower brackets, elimination match, 2-0 down. Too much pressure. I think even, like, Marky would have a hard time. I mean, Yaoi had a hard time, right? But I think if they swapped Yaoi during upper brackets, less pressure, 2-0, sure. But there's no pressure, because it's like, if we lose, we still have another uh, chance, you know? Where's the poll? The, it's draft, bro. I'll, I'll send the poll after the draft. I to get a Nolan win, at least for the playoffs, if I remember right, you know, earlier on. Yep. Uh, but it, one thing that's very right. clear here is the fact that what we Nolan pick, Fairmiss, Mathilda, Fredrin, Vaksha, Angela ban. Still the Fanny and Joy ban. Left the Nolan up. Sensui's That's Nolan is pretty, pretty this disgusting, too, to be honest. They need to be able to contest Sensui is just pretty disgusting as, a, as an individual. Sure, He's so fine, fucking good at video games, bro. His retry is actually ridiculous. Here, especially when it gets to the Lord. 
I'm looking yeah, for your live stream yesterday. I need your po POV in their drafts. I'm sorry, bro. Yesterday I was I was casting MBL. Couldn't uh, restream. Whoa, early Brody. Whoa, hey, hey, early Brody. Oh, 4-0. Oh, this guy's saying 4-0. Oh. Brody and Valen. Good Valen against the Fairmus and the Matilda, but maybe Red can just choose to overwhelm the Valen with more C with more big ultimates. Heck, I, oh, they already picked Matilda Fairmus, so Minotaur out of the equation already. What do they go for here? They secure a Marchman. Marchman is gonna be definitely gonna be banned next. Marco Marco is one of the goal laners who rarely picks up like the Aerith though for some reason. I've seen like he plays Beatrix, Brody and stuff that's okay. why it's so prior with the brody i think that's why blacklist picked it they knew they know that it's like phobius boys remember ab brendan did this against echo i believe right the phobius pick oh my lord then the esme ban straight in see guys this is what i'm talking about red side this what remember what i said about red side remember what i said about red side you get to counter pick twice if it goes into the jungle, gentlemen, I think I'm gonna lose it. Yeah. Oh, last time we might have. Phobius mid? No, it's Phobius. It should be Phobius XP, guys. There's a Matilda and a Faramis. Yeah, I don't think it's Phobius mid. It, it if it's Phobius mid, that'll be weird. Like Faramis XP? Matilda XP? Matilda jungle? Nah. It should be Phobius uh, XP. Faramis uh, mid. Matilda Rome, guys. For APB. Blacklist International, one way that they might be able to... Marco loves this. Clint. Marco uh, loves or, Brody, Clint, Beatrix. Because you see their first three picks. Um, what else? Uh, that's a lot of burst damage. Yeah, those are his heroes. Similar to how Echo wanted to play up against um, the more high-sustained lineup of Blacklist International. Phobius for counter Nolan, burst. yes. For but countering Nolan and technically also to counter the uh, Valentina. But also, guys, I, I would actually say maybe you don't see Phobius a lot in your rank games. Phobius is actually pretty broken. It's actually pretty good. I was very surprised that Phobius was not contested at all in MPL Indonesia after the patch. Um, maybe they were just sticking to the old meta or sticking to what works. They didn't want to really experiment too much. But Phobius is a big problem, dude. You gotta deal with Really, like even for Marksman, Marksman's like Brody, you rarely use your dash technique for to escape oh, right. you still get fucked by by phobius your ult is so fast that it can follow any dash right now and um they have an opportunity yeah to wind down, it, right so you can you get this place so well, easily right now i'm expecting burst, flap to go right? flame shot get, here to utilize the flame shot phobius you jump once you get flame shot you get another and then maybe dude i think ap bren might be able to go for something like an akai overwhelming the Valentino with some big ultimates some more big ultimates right so there's a there's gonna be a Mathilda there's gonna be a Fairmus, but the Akai has been banned that's why it's it's a good combo with Phobius I didn't see the, the Akai ban until now I'm sorry I just saw the Akai and Irithel ban Uranus Esme the two heroes that that do well AB Bren I think at this point they can just hide the they can just go for a uh, a jungler first, and then gold lane they pick later. But no, they go Clint. I expected the Clint because it's such an unorthodox pick to be picked last. Because why not pick a jungle first to to go for it? But I guess they want to save it for the last pick. What jungle is good here? Fredrin Bakcha banned out. Uh, against a Nolan, Nolan. Martis is actually quite good against a Nolan. No cap, pretty good. But it's a Kaja and Terizla. Martis. Oh wait, we got we have the Ohio brothers fans here in the building. Okay. What else aside from Martis? Fanny's man. Lancelot is. Nah. I don't know. Can Lancelot work here? They need to be really sick Guinevere. how they're going to dive onto this Clint. They can't allow it to free. Melissa, good for That's Nolan. Dude, Melissa will get shat on by Nolan wrong. hard. Love the Clint. Super Marco, one of the only players to usually play this hero. But it's scary because looking across from you, having a Kaja, having a Nolan. Mm -hmm. That, those two alone. So right? I miss you your shout out, so UA. Your shout, UA, and I expect to shout here. again, UA in M5. Hopefully, man. Second, yeah, there you so go. The Martis comes in. And this is what As they expected, do I'll go. My, my, it's not like the, the best pick here. It's well, technically, it's the best pick considering so all the bands, all the other jungle bands. But 
Yeah. So with the I'm, Mardis pick up, there's no other Matilda pick. The Landslot doesn't do too well. The Mardis is probably the safest one to go for. So yeah, there you go, guys. That's the draft for game numero uno. What do you guys think? A game, well, sorry, game number two. I forgot. AP Bren or Blacklist International, guys? There's the poll. Vote right now in the polls. I'm going to get some orange water. The gator of whatever Blacklist wants to do. But you immediately need to get back to Super Marco. Yeah, but again, we're, this is Super Marco we're talking about. There are times where I wouldn't be surprised if we actually ricocheted our ball last forward to get into Some another fresh round water. Range. Yeah. So Yo, AB Brand with 61%. Way, didn't it, expect I that. Did dying, not expect that. What's up? Backline. No one plays Assassin's now except Nolan. Again, any lineup that has yeah. in this current metagame. Just tends to Kyle plays Assassins, but Joy and Fanny were both banned. Flapdies is going to be playing it. I'm trying to remember when when did Fovia show up again in the middle? Well, game crazy. face, game face, game face, game time? face, game face. They did the it's game the face. You have to do the game face. Chop to who fell that the smoke? Right, game face done, 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 done. Let's go. Chop to who game face? <laughs> Let's go, boys. The most iconic Fovia player. I'm actually so hyped for MPLPH. Really, really. I cannot wait to watch AP Bren blacklist. Uh, Pandora game one was very underwhelming though, so hopefully game two gets off. hype. Gentlemen, here we go. Game number two, blacklist with a better draft this time around. First pick in the Nolan. Is this going to be enough to get them into this match? Finally putting one on the board. Okay, so blacklist uh, would want fast here. And What's look, up, Kamran? Already here. This is going to be heavy work. Emblems. The That's a thrill. That's the thrill. And Weapon Master, so very aggressive. That might be what Rupture Weapon Master as well from the Clint. Right now. Both goal laners going and ham, bro. And update you as it develops in terms of who is more present in the map. Gentlemen, what do you all reckon? Fighter Emblem Fovius with a little bit of Fighter HP Emblem there. Fovius. He'll need to really be sustained here because uh, they need another High chance Yawi won't stay in Echo, yeah. After Fovius. last time. Let's see, let's see. Seeing right now, too, just the aggression. Right? Shout out Idol America watching for the Philippines. Let's go. Zero quickly. tenacity. Because tenacity is for noobs. For this game you noobs. So far. Uh, Don't go tenacity. Time, Don't be a bitch. Like said, go full my, my damage like an act, like a real man. Chad. Because I feel like he's able to do the hitman things with the Kaja in his hands. It's just like... If you utilize that flicker divine This is a very interesting lean though. Can you actually the, um, because of the fact Fovius Terizla lane. Terizla should have more it. prio, but so far Flap's doing Every quite well. Jim, and he actually went for flicker, yeah. so not flame shot. Yo, thank you so much. Three SGD from Fierza. Mirkers or Mir Bless. Let's see. Let's see if it's Mirkers or Mir Bless. This is literally it's literally Mirkers or Mir Bless. Mir Bless, A B Bren champions. Mirkers, Blacklist wins. Because I predicted Blacklist to be knocked out in the first round. Nice divine judgment, bro. Judgment goes in. Oh, good with penalty, Jones. Rock house dead for sure. Oh no, he got the red rope. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Kyle, another body falls. Kyle TZ will go ahead. Dude, Pew is a god. Dude, no, 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 no. Pew. With that auto attack from Oak. No, no, no. We gotta watch that again. Look at the save from Pew, bro. Turtle started up. Oh, Dude, Kyle had no chance to live. Fucking Pew. Oh my lord, Few, you're so fucking good and at video games, bro. That's a fighter jet, Matilda. Holy shit, Few. Basic attack. Dude, Few is so underrated, champ. Oh, he's not underrated, the but he's... That we don't give him enough credit, man. He's so good. Will try to pick off. That's just a sign for I have so much respect for the, the, the like, players like like this, uh, Few and Flap, who have been in the game for so long, and are still good. Because those are the players that are very rare. Like, we don't see that a lot of Indo. Players who are so who have been playing since like so season envious. one, who wants. are still godly. I, I want to be number one with that. But oh, the most <laughs> damage taken. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it just goes to show, and I think it really does back up the narrative around uh, Edward and how integral he is to Black. Shout out Idol, what's uh, up, Francis? Uh -huh. uh, the Loki Goat? I think Carl is still the Goat, though. Edward, uh, alongside um, the other members of Black International tanking damage. Well, specifically him. Yeah, mostly him. Like, yeah. his, the lineup can have almost zero. You are Gila Sans, still Sans, man. It, and it would be A OK. I still got to give it to Sans for mid lane. Mind. No matter uh, what game, and even, you know, yesterday when we were on the panel talking about Edward alone. Mr. Consistent. For a gold like, lane, probably I've, I've always been a Marco fan. Because he's, uh, he's my brother. And I'm Super Mirko, it's, he's it's Super Marco. You know, we, we twins. <laughs> yeah. uh, we, both like a, we both played a... We both are really good at gold <laughs> lane. Zero, I think I might be a little bit better, though. Just a little bit. Ching ching. There it is. It, it, there's a nice ring to it. It's my baby brother. <laughs> but right now, can't believe it. Whoa. Bovius coming back. 
and mostly because of the Nolan. But then at the same time, I think it's just a good read by AP Bren because, and uh, I know AP Bren isn't the first time to run. You think Haji's still, still the best mid laner in PH? Sa Sanji? Oh, Sanji? Beforehand, uh, mm, in the last I think mechanically, so, Sanji's still. No, Yue is probably the best so mid laner in PH right now. And how I like Yue is. I've been watching, and, uh, even yesterday I watched. Yue is so fucking good, dude, especially on Valentina. That's why I'm expecting this game to be good. Because he got Valentino. Ue, Ue has improved so much, time. bro. Seriously. Look at where they're planning themselves. Did not expect so Ue to be crazy. Because I'm, I'm, I'm a Haji, exactly I'm a Haji fan, Something so I'm technically biased to his competitor. <laughs> but yeah, no, Ue, no cap. Actually, like legit. Probably yeah, the best mid laner in like PH right now. Early endless battle. Yeah, he's going to be rushing that. Actually, Naisu, I have to apologize. You asked me yesterday what's the priority for Clint. I said Berserker. Whoa, Circling Eagle. Opening. Renegade. Divine Judgment. Oh, they're going to. Go oh, all in. Oh, good dead. They can't take that back. Oh, Jeez. Falls. Doesn't matter if so, Sensui died Black once, huh? No, it's just that busted. Jeez, you say that one shot, bro? And just as a reminder, it was earlier today, man. It was yesterday. Yeah. Oh, that, that was yesterday. <laughs> it's, it's been a ridiculous weekend. <laughs> it's been a long weekend. Holy yeah. shit, right, Miracle. So, I just finished Devil Man Cry, baby. You're right. Back and that's, uh, this I anime is fucking goaded, dude. Form, right? Every and recommendation I make will be goaded. I shit you not. If I recommend you a bad show, then I will donate money to you, bro. Okay. Okay. That's a lot of damage, dude. Yo, what? That's a tank, bro. That's a frontliner. He just deleted Edward. Is that worth it? A turret for Edward. Should be worth it for Blacklist, but Edward's the main playmaker. If he falls too behind it, and if Flacteezy is able to get like a level lead, that might be... Might be a problem. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know about this. Nice divine judgment. Renegade. Renegade gets the grab with the divine judgment. Oh, win. Oh, good. Tried his best with what he had. Not going to happen, though, as he falls under the turret. That's a moment there. We're in the revamp. Matilda may have been better off just being the old version. Yeah. It caught the Brody, it caught Oleb, and it went right underneath the turret. Hey, at least AP Brand caught something down bottom. That's a tier one push. Yep, they trade out towers, but that was an error by AP Brand. No other way to put it there. Ogun if Kyrie wins M5, do you think he's the goat in? He's the goat in Indo. Well, huh? This is a great he might be actually, yeah. Probably will be. Wait, 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 fight, fight, fight. Edward gonna be in trouble. Oh, dude, the these fights are just amazing. not gonna go well for Blackness, huh? Run, turtles gonna reset. Oh my Fobia God! Duncan after Dunk gets the, the kill. The team fight comp of glory, bro. Now it's AP Bren's turtle to take. Oh the hit man. The hit man. And with those two picks, AP Bren are so way. good. What AP the Bren's heck? Out, even with that retribution spent early on, I really want to commend. I have a question. What would happen in Indonesia if Kyrie, yeah, Beloisky, and Maki stop playing there? Well, I think the teams that they are in won't be as good, for sure. With the penalty zone, he had to use it to try and escape. Fovies is good. Yeah. Yeah, dude, against the Nolan, against the Valentina, against even Renege uh, on the Kaja, and no, say yeah, see ya, Oheb. Troublesome, Oheb. Can you do any magic here? See ya, Oheb. Comes through. There's a dunk. Not gonna be enough. I thought Renege would be able to do something. Marco. Ouch. That's all we could say. The damage on this cowboy. Brent's dive comp is deadly. Yeah, their team fight is disgusting. AP Brent's wow, team fight is insane. If you look closely, Fovis kind of looks like Flap Teasy in the portrait. It's meant to be. <laughs> just give it oh, a because of the hair. Flap. Okay, so right. Renmar just said that Fovis looks like Flap Teasy. Do you guys again. agree? Do you guys agree? Does Flap right Teasy look guys, like Phobius? Like Does Phobius look like Flap Teasy, chat? Look at the, the, the picture. The Does that look okay. like Flap Teasy? One of the keys that allows me to say, hey, maybe it's not so <laughs> similar, is the fact that Blackers are a little more aggressive on their trades. They have made a dent on the map more than they ever have in game number one. They push that tier one up top, Fall down teasy. bottom, and that allows for Renege and Sensui to kind Isn't of Isn't that like plays. an insult? They what? No. Phobius really isn't ugly. In the mid -game He's just purple. Just you so racist to purple people, dude? What the they fuck? Pick up the tempo, pick up the pace, Why are there ads every five minutes? Wait, what? Said the night, AP dude, not the setting is literally on the, like, it's the furthest one away. It's every 30 minutes. That's the, that's literally the, the longest estimated frequency there's one 6 12 18 24 and 30 i picked the one with the longest one what the fuck it might actually be devastating for them because we know how blacklist like to play they actually like to 
Stick Which team do you think Yaoi should go? In, in this Aura. Scenario right now, Still the same org. Like we can't hear you? What? Wait. How? Wait, guys. Is the audio actually garbage or are these people trolling me? Do I? Can you guys not hear me? Is the audio bad? What, what's going on? Because it shouldn't be bad. Blacklist been farming up to close that gap. Keeping it close to a thousand. Lord spawned. AP Brand first okay. to the scene. Oh, he's amazing. All right. right now. Okay, thank you, thank you. This is going to be a full-on fight for this one. Blacklist International does not want to give this objective away as they have for the previous Turtles. Kyle Teasy knows oh, it. No. There's Flap. Since we used the dash already. Push him back, but Flap, but we'll yo, that's actually a good bait. Here. This is Lord actually is a winning well fight for Blacklist, guys. That's a weird winning fight. What? How? Dude, they baited the demonic the force already. Oh my lord, you got it. It's only a what? Yo, okay, how long does the demonic force like have? How long? The Lord, He's already right proc'd it. He used demonic force. How is it still up by that time? They went AP in a bit too early. They should have waited a bit more. Oh, Matt Hardy's somewhere and saying, Dude, they baited it really well already. Oh no. Yo, it's 2 0. Wait, no, no, not yet. No, not endable. Not endable. Not endable. Unless they get a pick. Coming in. Okay, now it's endable. They got a lord. Nah. Nah, no way. No way. No way. Nah, no way. No way. Holy shit. Quite a lead. They're going to take the discipline route and just back off for now and get these turrets. Lower the game volume? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. YouTube audio too loud? All right. I'll, I'll, I'll put it down a bit. Sorry. AB Bren Avenge Echo, please. 15 seconds before reset. Dude, they. I think they went in a bit too early because like... I think they were they were thinking about going in for the fight and the Lord, right? I feel at that moment, the only thing you can look for is one. Either you get the Lord or you get the fight, right? If you look for both, you're a bit too greedy. Because you already baited the Demonic Force. Might as well just go for the fight. Like, leave the Lord. I mean, sure, Lord AP Ben will get it. But as long as you get a good fight, right? I don't know if they are still able to win those. I think without Demonic Force, they are able to win those, man. They know exactly what the next step I is. lowered it. Is it good already, guys? Lowered the caster volume. Is it good or no? All of their resources. Nolan, since he's struggling, look at this. He's crossing the river, getting sneaky with that purple, and now top lane's in trouble. Can you bless my midterm exam? You're gonna be, you're gonna do amazing in your midterm exams, my guy. Black International will hold on. Where is this saving grace for Blacklist to get back into this game? It's hard to find, honestly, uh, with the lineup that they have, it was very dependent on... Fight in the chat? Wait, really? Is fight chicken in the chat? That's not the real fight chicken, guys. The the fight chicken, uh, the fight chicken is um, checked, has a check mark, and um, also has moderator in my chat. How did we put it before? To defend your <laughs> Guy's about to fail. Lose bodies. <laughs> yeah, and that's what Blacklist has here. If there were ahead, this cursed student exactly. Your school will never have a holidays there. again, sir. Problem, but right now, <laughs> you're staring down a Who did Miracle predict to win this match? AP Bren. I'll open the prediction video after this, okay, to show you guys my predictions. That means it's not so easy to farm up on OEB. It's not so easy for in the gr grand final. Well, technically, I got everything in AP Bren's bracket correct. Because I predicted AP Brand all the way till till right grand now. finals. Hitman, then everything else I got wrong. Okay. Purple buff. Gonna be a purple dance. Let's see if Blacklist can take it. Not sure if they actually want to go ahead. Oh whoa whoa! They, they use Red Tree there. Kyle used Red Tree. They they they're really taking their time with this Lord then. Or they're just trying to bait out a fight, which is basically what their composition is is meant to do anyways. Supposed to just bait out fights. Talk about awareness. Sensui is in mid. Few has has info. They know where Sensui right? is. Good pull by Kyle. This is a good reset angle. Marco gets purple buff. The retrie's back up at eight. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's actually worse for Blacklist International. That's not good use for them. Yeah, Flaptezi has purple buff and Super Marco has purple buff. They're two carries at purple buff, dude. Yes, I call I call Flap Easy to carry. Few is more of utility this this match. On the on the fair miss. Oh, Sensui, Sensui! Oh my God, dude! Can he get out with his life? 
DDP Bren Sensui, you fucking him, Sensui did the job. beautiful, he beautiful retro user. What the hell? This game. It doesn't matter. Oh, he fucking died. nerd. Dude, this guy's this guy's retro is out of this world. Holy shit! A bit more of the map. I shit you and not, he probably he is the best retro user right now. Blindsided. He's probably number one retro in the world. Dude. Oh my lord, Sensui, you retri goat. This guy is scary, dude. Dude, dude, dude. Dude, that's so cool. Maybe Bren, the reason why they have this economic lead and itemization and everything else, even with that Lord Steel, as great as it was. What does it lead to? Basic still number one? Not so much. Nah, Just I think it's Sensui. Nile versus Sensui? I think Sensui. Sensui is uh, Retri, number one. And at this point for Blacklist International, of course, you just want to find those somethings. Up to a BOD already is the marksman of AP. Maybe basic wins, guys. Basic number one Retri got still, right? I mean, we, we know that. <laughs> But we can't compare to the real, we can't compare actual retries to real life retries like basic. Basic is the goat. <laughs> that meme will never die, I swear to God. You guys always talk about that shit, bro. <laughs> MPL PH borrowed MPL MY curse. Your thoughts about the statement of Coach TikTok? I didn't see the statement of Coach TikTok. I'll, I'll check it after this. Any prediction? Prediction on my exam? You're gonna fail your exam, sir. You're gonna fail it hard. You're not gonna do well at, on your exams at all. just working out that counterplay from Blacklist, and you can't blast them. Like, let's say you do find few, and you take him down before the Nether is triggered. Oh, 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 oh! Flappy just opened that shit. Oh, that's some, that's some damage. They're going in. They're going in. Oh, that's some dive. Yo, Flappy just go. Bro, 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 bro. Bro. Oh no. Oh, he's dead. Oh no. He flickered. Dude, this dive is ridiculous. They can't do anything. You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying about the phobias, guys? It's so broken. This hero is stupid. I swear to God. This hero is so stupid, and it's so easy to play. Look, here, I'll show you how to play Phobius, all right? The most brain-dead hero in MLBB, I swear to God. At least Fanny takes skill. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Again, again, look, 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 flop teasy, flop teasy. Camera, camera on flop teasy. This is the, this is the hand cam from ca flop teasy. Look at this, look at this fan cam, boys. This is a hand cam from flop. This is it, this is it. The one finger power, sir. The Flap TZ Gaming, Phobius Gaming, sir. <laughs> this is it, this is it, this is all you do on fucking Phobius. Garbage hero, but so good. Dude, we, I want a hand cam on Flap, bro. Hand cam on Flap, Flap po playing Phobius. He's probably playing on one hand, just drinking some coffee while playing, bro. What the heck? God damn. God damn, chat. 2 0. -oh. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. Blacks International is 8 Tap Tap Gaming. This is it. This is it. What happened in game number one? The single finger tapper. I will say there was. Yeah, Trash Hero was so good. That was. Dude, Bren's drafts have been amazing, really. Shout out to Bren and Ducky. Their drafts have been very, very good. And so, again, I don't know what Black International needs to do. Because uh, it feels like there's so many things yeah. that they need to adjust here. On Tap the TZ. Can we call him that? Tap this, TZ. That's his like Phobius nickname. My, the, my it's not Flap TZ. That right there. That's Tap TZ. Like, is Phobius actually worth banning? Like, <laughs> do, you, do you actually want to ban Look this, at this hero cat, now guys. that has come what are you back doing, from the, hmm? the what are you past, doing? if okay. you will? To add to that question and to maybe help Renmar answer, I actually like Flap TZ's Phobius more than Fuse. Yeah. They had to win via comeback when they put the tap tap liar Now, Flappy just seems so comfortable. <laughs> I'm buying it. Maybe Pando did. Marco or Mirko, right? exactly. we're both very good. I am I a bit better, though. Right tap TZ. In three letters to call back when Tap TZ got that Phobius, man. God damn. Hello, Mirko from KH. Right, What's well, up, man? Um, our analyst has a little fuck, bit more I forgot to add what to that. hello we or welcome is in Cambodia. The host taught me, but I only remember the dirty words. Damn, 2-0. You guys, that draft was crazy, though.
Watch Echo post game interview. Manager of Echo reveals the issue. Okay, okay, okay. Where, where, uh, which clipper? Echo post game or post match interview. Is there a translation? They're probably going to be speaking in uh, Tagalog, right? Does anyone have um? I see it, but is this with translation? Chop the roof and let the smoke clear. Shoppy ad. Um, I'm very proud and Does any any clipper clip this guys? Did any clipper clip it? Because I cannot hear what they're saying. You know Elgin ML? Yeah, I love his videos, bro. Yo, I can't hear shit. Someone translate. Z killed? Oh, Z killed translated? Okay, okay. <laughs> What is this thumbnail, Z killed? It. <laughs> Chose the worst picture of me. <laughs> what the fuck is this, Z killed? Hey! Choose your the right thumbnails, nerd! <laughs> Fucking Z killed, dude. Travis ML. Z killed doesn't have it, it seems. Oh, this one? Is it this one? Sanford over Yaoi? Huh? Travis ML. Okay, Travis. Oh, that's not the right Travis ML. Okay. Ah, here. Got it. Okay. So, really planned this a long time ago. Okay. JP's wife? Oh, their manager is JP's wife? Echo manager is JP's um, wife? Since Aura days. Majority of the majority of the 
And the, the coaches and the mayors decided that I am not going to go And then, see, si, si every week, we go to the And I know, but it's not going to go to the I try to fix everything internally. Yung plano is, sinasabi ko naman sa kanya, uh, we're going to run sila ng miscommunication ko dahil ikaroon na tapos niya ako dun sa apat kasi na, na, na parang nagkaroon na majority decision may pass up sila. But I try to tell him na wala na talagang problem niya apat. It's just, you know, parang sa script kasi doon din na base. And, sorry, yun. Yeah. So, uh, this is script data. So, we have numbers, stats, and evaluation. And however, that time, parang humihiwala yun na si Yawe, lagi yung sinasabi sa kanya, Yawe, parang, ano, huwag ka pa sa mga kasama mo. And of course, the other part is they're, they still try to reach out. So, yun, gusto ko lang malaman ng lahat kasi hindi ko lang nagugustuhan yung parang mga <coughs> bantang nila sa akin. Parang tinapit ko naman lahat. Yeah, okay. I got it. I got it, basically. I mean, I... We can watch the entire clip again, but I think it's just more of like, um, yeah, it's more of just like the same thing. It's trust, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's more of the same thing. So, I don't know, guys. I feel like Chapter oh, it's one thing to not agree with management. It's one thing to say like, oh, Yaoi should have played. If you guys want to say free Yaoi or if you want to take Yaoi's side, it's completely fine. But yeah, though, threatening the manager, threatening the, the fa like family, saying that you're going to beat them up in the venue and shit. There's always fans like that everywhere in Indo, in Philippines, everywhere around the world. Those are the fucking dumbasses uh, who don't really deserve to have internet. But yeah, that, those, that, like, that's pretty disgusting. The people who, who do that, <laughs> fucking <laughs> disgusting, man. Don't, don't ever do that, guys. Don't ever fucking... Uh, yeah. Don't, don't ever do that. that. That's very shameful if you guys do that. You guys should not be able to get internet. And you have to understand as well that I think that, like they, they put it uh very they explained it quite well right they were basing it off of scrims and based on scrims apparently uh jp was just performing better the team preferred playing with jp uh after that they had an 11 game streak so yeah again 11 game streak it's pretty reasonable like why they did not want to change they want to keep the momentum i think it's pretty reasonable this is this isn't uh, like a, a random community tournament. This isn't a random like. This is their jobs, literally. This is the these are their careers, right? So obviously they will try to find the the best formula, and maybe this time it wasn't with Yaoi and based on scrims, etc. You know, uh, and Yaoi could obviously improve, and then they can come back and stuff. But I think this is this is the problem, uh, for a lot of different teams and a lot of different like I would say a lot of careers are ruined because of of this. You should always be able to differentiate a, your professional relationship and your personal relationship. Never mix those two together. Like, say, uh, I'll just talk about the English desk in Indonesia as an example, right? I will literally bash every single caster on the English desk, and they are also okay. I will take every single bashing from all of my fellow like co-casters if I make a mistake, if they make a mistake, they'll get bashed. I'll tell them what to improve on. I'll tell them, bro, why the fuck are you so shit today? What happened? Why didn't you do this? Why didn't you do that? And if I made the mistake, they would do the same to me. But right after that, we never bring that to our personal lives. Like we never actually take it to heart. It's all because we want to improve together. And it's all because, you know, we're a team, right? And I think the fact that they got angry uh, as to like why they, they're, they're not playing, etc. That that's already kind of fucky. Uh, the fact that they merged both professional and personal relationships. I'm sorry, guys, but your feelings don't fucking matter when you're when you're doing like a job. It's about who does it better, right? It's it's a career. This ain't this ain't pussy kindergarten preschool time anymore. Okay, it's time to get real serious. And uh, sometimes facts are hard to swallow, but facts are facts. Uh, yeah. So just. You got. You just don't take it personally. Don't take it to heart. Don't be a little bitch. Uh, and I think if everybody was able to do that, to keep the the two different like um, relationships, I think they would have been fine. But they are very young. The players. They are very young. I think the management definitely. I think took some different routes. I think for sure uh, they 
it, it fucking feels bad to be Yaoi as well because I think in that interview as well, uh, the, the manager said that they were going to give um, you know, Yaoi a chance to play when JP made a mistake. But then because of momentum, they just kept on going, kept on... Uh, yeah, they kept on using JP. And that, that definitely fucking feels bad for Yaoi, right? Because he expects to play. He was waiting for his moment to just play and prove himself. Maybe he's not a scrim player. And that has happened many times before as well. Teams who... Don't do well in scrims, but do amazing on stage. That happens a lot, guys. That happens more than you think. I swear to God. Like, you cannot... Scrims are important, but you cannot base... You have to give your players a chance as well on stage. And I think yesterday with the win on Kufra as well, it showed, like, maybe that he's a stage player. He's, he's a big game player. He doesn't... Maybe he doesn't perform in these low-stake scenarios, especially t uh, players who already have, like, experience, who already have... Um, Ch championships, you know, that they they sometimes don't give a fuck about uh, their scrims. They don't give a fuck about practice, which is a bad, uh, which is bad bad thing to have, bad habit to have. You should care about everything you do. But yeah, ha wait, Haji in? Wait, you guys serious? It's a lot of boxes. But Did I miss that? You call it, bro, bro, bro. Speaking the of devil, smoking. the Kadal machine, the Kadal machine. Oh my goodness! Is this how my bias? That's my bias, chat. That's my boy. That's my favorite player on BLCK. Oh my goodness! A Faramis. So the Kadal machine. Oh my lord! Being off between you and Renegade. Is there chemistry off? That's a question. Well, he is. Instrumental to Blacklist showing up the Holy most shit. in all of the history of our international... KDA Machine finna destroy few? Oh my god, KDA Machine is back. The Kadam Machine, guys. Oh my lord. I'm actually hyped now. If Haji wins, bro... Nah, you know what? Give me a while. I will try to find... So my house is undergoing renovations and it's like all my jerseys are in a box. I'm gonna try to find that jersey. No, I can't. I can't. It's all in a box. It's. I have a Haji jersey. That's the only jersey I bought, guys. I, I, not the only jersey I bought, but I got a blacklist jersey and it's with Haji. And I got him to sign the jersey, but I washed it, and then it it disappeared. The fucking signature, Haji signature, disappeared. So I'm gonna have to get it again. But luckily he made his M5, so I can get it get it again. Kadam machine should play jungle. <laughs> Yo, Ellie, welcome to the Alpha Squad. Thank you so much. Chapter Big up. Let this smoke clear. Thank you so much. Join the Discord, don't forget. Ellie, you guys better, but sometimes it was the matchup. Mm, maybe. They did the same thing with Rafflesia. Oh, yeah? Haji Mir cursed. Sorry, black fans. Hey! Do they try to do Marky now? Yeah, they, they basically are trying to do the Marky now. At this point, they need to try to use, like, everything in, everything in their arsenal. Mirko! Yo, what's up, Jays? How you doing, man? Masin Kadah Kambali Kadah Machine. But is it not sure... Is it... Is it not sure that Yaoi will not get out of Echo? What team do you think he'll be looking forward to go to? I don't know. I don't know where Yaoi will, will go. I think I'll, I'll try to... I don't know. Bren drafting is insane. Bren drafting is insane, bro. I swear. They've been winning both drafts, I think. Please vote for Bren. I already did predict Bren, bro. Remember, I predicted Bren for my Mirkurs prediction. It's about to be Mir Bless, man. The Mirkurs allegations. It, it might not be Mirkurs. It might be Mir Bless, bro. Unless Haji suddenly just comes in and goes big boy. Why did you pick Bren? Because Bren. This meta, I feel like Bren has the best meta. Did you not see what you have once, what you have done? That's not my fault, man. RSG MY, RSG PH, RSG SG. I, 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 maybe it is all that is I curse all the RSG. All right, game two. Game three, sorry. Game three, boys. Is it going to be 3-0 or is it going to be 2-1? The Kadal machine is in. 
Baby boo. Let's go. RG hates this man. RG, I'm sorry, by the way. I'm, I'm, I truly am sorry. I did not. I truly was supporting every single one of your teams. I shit you not. I'm not joking, RG, all right? I don't know, man. <laughs> okay, you have a great stream. I'm going to go back to watch party. Hey, watch party with me, bro. What the fuck, Jays? Yeah, we the Bigatron Alpha. I don't think Pikachron uh, need a roamer right now. I think they need a uh, maybe gold lane. Alright, Ibi Ren. First pick, Edith. That's a signature pick for the man, the myth, the legend. Oh, Gwen. Mirko, make a poll. Poll will be after the drafts, my guy. Every single time, after the draft. Edith, Terizla, Fermis. Valentina is still open. Ibi Ren can just pick up the Valentina right now. Matilda is still open as well. Wow. But they already picked up the Edith. Edith can go XP. They can technically force it. We might see something different here. Like how many defensive penalties? Whoa, Martis and L the D what? Martis Lilia. No Very early. They're going for full poke and just one. execute, yeah. bro. And just like God damn. Drafted against Blacklist International. Recruit Yaoi to Indo for a turn. <laughs> I think you have to call the Indo teams for that. Kaja pick here is still the same for Blacklist International. What's with basic Retro God meme? Context, please. You got to find the context on your own, man. That's a part of the journey. If you've, if you've, if you've, find, if you've just joined the MLBB esports scene, you have to find out by yourself, man. <laughs> Super Marco Gold Standard. Yo, what up, Mirko? Pride of Malaysia. What's up, Harvey? Pride of Malaysia. <laughs> w fans, Mirko. What's up? I think they should try Haji Rome. Ooh, Haji Rome would be cho god. That'd be interesting. If he wins M5, he's the new goat of PH. Yeah. If he wins M5, yeah. You this was their plan. Where did Spun Sun Sparks go? I don't know. Is that a celebrity, guys? You see those dimples? This guy is a celebrity? What's his name, guys? We got a job to do. We got a job to do. We'll talk to Alden later. Can we? Isn't isn't he uh eSport owner? He's also Alden Richards. I see. Alright, now you were saying, Renmar. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Mirko is in the building. No, I'm not. <laughs> Alden Richards. Uh, Re Alden Richards. Okay. <laughs> Filipino fan working in Saudi Arabia. Absent at work today to watch your restream. Bro. W mans, man. Work is for noobs. Come on. Let's play. Let's, let's watch. You on better data band, though. Respect to 5TZ. They still think that Edith's going to be roaming. And I think the same, too. Edith is really good roam. And I think 5TZ needs a playmaking hero. Giving 5TZ a, a, an Edith would be kind of a waste. Mithil Wait, uh oh. Mathilda That's... Jungle, guys. Gentlemen, can I just say? Mathilda I'm Jungle, guys. Yes. Mathilda Jungle. Shout out to KB. Yep. KB no played Mathilda Jungle, and he told me Mathilda Jungle is actually like, it's not yeah. good, but it's viable. Uh, there's a reaction. I don't know if it's actually going to be Mathilda Jungle, though, because that's very troll. Kaja Jungle? Kaja Jungle makes more sense, but I swear to God, guys. Mathilda Jungle? I've seen it before. But maybe after the nerf, it's not viable anymore. I don't know. What are the actual fuck? Exactly. But KB played Matilda in the jungle and he told me, Yo, Mirko, I, I like it. And I was like, You like a lot of things, man. You like a lot of weird shit. Like, you like playing random shit in the jungle, bro. bro. But we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Safe one, Kaja jungle. But if they want to go full KB, fucking let's go, ham, YOLO, 420 blaze it, it's probably going to be Matilda jungle. Matilda XP, no. XP, never, never, no way. Terizla. They need gold lane. Jungle Kaja then? Well... We not the first time. Yeah, it's not the first that. time. We I mean, saw it before. Different jungler, but hey, since Sui, since Sui can do anything at this let's point. Let's see, let's see what with it. Oh, oh, it's going to be Kerry. Oh, whoa! Yep. Ixia. I thought it was Kerry. Ixia. Okay, it is Kaja jungle. Ooh. Boring. <laughs> Okay, let's look at that. Boring. The numbers can help out here. Support Mathilde, Kelly, come on, man. Game three. <laughs> so, TOT, damage over time uh, from AP Bren. Still very close. Burst, a little bit more AP Bren leaning. Team fighting for Blacklist looks really good. Maybe Blacklist, AP Bren, guys. Kaja Jungle. Could be a double edged sword. That was definitely forced, bro. If they make it work, they're W, but I don't think it's going to work. 
I think that was very forced. Very, very forced. With, uh, very, very forced. Kaja ultimate, but it's been a long time since we've seen Kaja jungle, and for a reason, he was nerfed. This, this, it was a misclick? Oh, no. This isn't the way you want to start with Haji coming Mirko, back. in the case of Yaoi, is the same from yep. Felicia when JP got favored. Ah, See, may maybe it has happened before. Story, the reactions was uh, them trying to get in our heads now. It's more pleasant than yeah. I expected if it was indeed a wrong pick. Yeah. Oh, game right, face. Jungle Kaja. Cool right, there we have a specific group for alphas in Discord. Well. Uh, yes, there's a specific group, so go and request it in the request channel. Game number three. AP Ben with 62% of the votes in my chat for the polls. Let's get it. Blacklist versus AP Ben. All the pressure's on now. One more match okay, for this, match, uh, or one more game for match point. Marco, Marco. This is not a lane you win, buddy. He's using this unorthodox lineup if you will to get some of these objectives in their favor in the early game it's just the, 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 the best the fucking bully in lane row cod jungle Although inspire season the hunter we'll tank this, emblem we still get the okay we can expect that Black especially Sinatra, i don't know i don't, know. I, I don't like the cod jungle very very quickly so they're going to combine the since so we play cod jungle back in onic ph guys combat speed and I don't know. Is, is there enough damage to make the most of that? Is there enough of uh, communications between them now since it's Haji playing? This oh, is good zone here. Him. He's not. Oh, what? He will be able to oh, yeah, not, no last hit. There you go. Divine judgment. I mean, that's a good thing about the Kaji jungle. Uh, rotational speed wise. No. Yeah, uh, mm. Still quite even, actually. Yeah, so I'm Haji bias as well. Going okay right now. And this Kaji jungle actually has a tank emblem set. Yeah, not only that. So, uh, you know, part of this, anytime you see an Ixia in play, right? You, she is the epitome of a glass cannon mm -hmm. gold lane marksman. And it could Why is the only one to play Kaja Jungle? So it's a blacklist lineup, special. As long as they can Ooh, let go buff stolen by point, few. Then they'll set themselves up here for success in some of those pickoffs, some of those fights early on. Now look at this. Look at this. Has look at this chunk. Away the gold buff from <laughs> okay. we'll good sustain, though. Very good sustain from uh, this, ca this Kaja. Very in control with this pick right now, so Man, what are you supposed to do against an Exborg who's gonna just zone you away like this? I understand the Kaja, like you use Divine Judgment to cancel out the Mortal Coil as like anti-CC. Good one, wow. Well played by Kyle there. Mortal Coil, well played. Oh, Sensui! Retsy God! How? He didn't have anything to help him there! Dude, ridiculous. That was not supposed to be a Sensui Retsy Retry win. Here. Wow. The kill. Right. Wow. What a Retry win. What's the economy on that, Reptar? Oh, Dude, well, Sensui's Retry is... is oh my God, it's so fucking Black stupid how good he is on Retry. Dude, Mardis was literally on his first skill, comboing it with Retry. And Sensui just taps the Retry, gets it. What, what a Chad. Chad Sensui. Yeah, there's about 500 gold here at three minutes in. Do not focus. Black Sensui instinct. God Sensui damn. Is just ever sharp. Kaja is fast in farming. Yeah, not bad actually. Sen Sensui Kaja. Kaja is not not bad at farming, but that retry is impressive. Really impressive. Is this triple support situation? But it's so hard to find a catch on Kaja jungle when you don't have flicker on Kaja. It's so hard to find a catch. It's yeah. like you literally you're a cover hero. You're not a well, I guess that's what they're going for against this comp, right? Against an well we, they have an Ixia, so there probably is gonna be a like, cover cover Kaja. They're just gonna try to cover and peel everyone away from the Ixia. So actually it makes sense, their composition. It makes a lot of sense. But the Lilia, Edith, and Beatrix might overwhelm them with damage. Damage output is crazy. Times two oh, when, times oh, when, 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 guiding win. Success. Not just Ogwen, even Super Mark got to spend his flicker. Oh, yes. He survived that whole uh, uh, rotation from Blacklist. So, yeah, big battle spell for your rotational speed. I'd say Blacklist. Free flicker with exactly Matilda, but it's a lot more telegraphed, guys. Flicker is like, there's no, there's no, you, you can't, it's very hard to predict a flicker. It's very easy to predict. Well, it's not very easy, but it's easier. It's telegraphed. You can see the Matilda dash forward first, so you can actually, like, you can think about it, you can you can react to it. Meanwhile, Flicker, old Kaja is like almost. Uh, it's almost impossible to react like to. You gotta kinda predict that. Okay, Kyle Teasy gets it. If oh, Sensui get gets it somehow, some way, that'll be weird. Oh, look at Oheb. 
two, go into the XP lane, push separately instead. To see if AP when we come to PH, probably M5, man. To give a bit more Realistically, time. probably M5. Don't think we'll be able to right, go to PH here. Right um, we're still at home, still in the Indo. Unfortunately, this but season again, we're not if you're early, um, time, going to be guest casting in PH. Next time. The English cast is late. It's okay. I don't think we're competing. We're all watching together, anyways, right? Like we're all here, just watching. Okay, so the newer build style on the Beatrix, where they're gonna build the Fury Hammer first and then go into the Blade of Despair, turn that into a Hunter. Kaja will dash into them, still very telegraphed. The Kaja dash is still very telegraphed. Like, again, that's why for roamers, right? Like, why Kaja is crazy roam is because that flicker combo, man. Once you use that flicker, it's very easy to just counter it, etc. And that's what we saw many times before. Nice Divine Judgment, man. Good pull. Right as the Farag armor got deleted. Good disengage. That's an immortality burn. Well played. And that's what we're looking flicker at. and immortality just for one flicker. Flap, Beautiful. He's, he's Beautifully done by Blacklist, man. Well played. And a flicker for a flicker and some ults from Blacklist. So again, there's a good amount of economy here. Resources being exchanged between these two teams, which allows for them to sit at 1-0 and oh, six minutes in. Yeah, and those lineup that Blacklist fielded actually, but wait, well that's how Kalti's is actually going for an invade. Yeah, let's see if you okay. Few got Ooh. it. Wow. Sensui though. Oh. Pretty upset about it. Will they pull the trigger? The no, first miss don't. of Sensui Retri so but far. <laughs> it's only on purple ball, so it does, it's, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. RQ and Kira are now here in PH. Hey. RQ. Arkira. So the, the lineup of Blacklist actually forced a flap TZ to build an immortality. Something that recent uh, Xbox players haven't been doing, which is that... First he missed it game one? Ah, I didn't watch game one, sorry. Now, but because of all of the things that can Circle Eagle. mess up the x he was Might be a bit too early to there, actually. Here. Sensui went to get his orange it's interesting that they're not bursting this down. Black okay, they finally see the Kaja. There you go. Looks like they're just going to call it again. Just giving up this turtle. Free turtle. AP Bren. Doesn't even need the Where red fee. Two turtles now. Being along for the ride. Oh, 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 hey, 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 boss. Okay. okay. <laughs> you prioritize objectives. And mm -hmm. again, we saw this in game one, uh, rather two. We saw this in game two. Uh, Blacks International said, we'll play the map. And then we'll go from there. I hope they're able to step on the clutch fast enough this time around. Yeah. Look at this, uh, Lilia. It's gonna be a problem for Blacklist International with every one of them wanting to step together. Uh, the good, the thing Blacklist would want to look for, and their best target actually for the Divine Judgment might actually be that Lilia, or if they really want to, Kyle Teasy. But let's see if they can even get to it, because uh, so it's such a this, passive uh, game, guys. Very passive, so very very passive. Beatrix has a gold lead. Right. But I'm, this I'm little gold it, lead, Iksha, it. Iksha going themselves. even is already the really fact, good. That's why Iksha is such a, a menace. Even if you go even, well, or even if you lose just a little bit, it's all good. Just, just keep him farming. And then, uh, yeah. This, Once he gets the, the item power spike, it's going to be massive. He's going to be able to deal so much damage. And the cover is already there for Blacklist, technically. It'll be a front to back battle. Blacklist team fight is actually going to be better when Iksha gets power spike, guys. This is quite scary for AP Ren. Man, every time you see that, right, you, you think they're going to push the go on it, but they don't. So, Black is International, it just seems like their plan is... Sleeper game? Yeah. Build mm, up not not much time. happening. Both teams playing super passive. Our eggs in the basket of he's farming, farming, farming. Is, is he where it needs to be? I mean, he's DHS got DHS Corrosion built up. Yeah, I think he's he building towards the Wind Talker though. next. 500 gold, give or take. Meanwhile, for the Beatrix, gold, Fury Hammer, BOD, right, Malefic Roar. Blacklist... Standard builds for both both gold lanes. Really Lord control rate. Oh, Kyle actually has better Lord control rate. Mm. After we see the Lord spawn, Kyle Teasy just a wee bit better at securing them. Oscar Peterson Sui stealing them though. That's a whole another story. Lord spawns up top. Uh oh. The higher quarter, uh oh. And now Blacklist okay. Since he doesn't go for no it. No dice doesn't want to force the issue. All five of them here present with. Did Blacklist have the better position for a for a for a team fight? Front, like a, if it's a clean team fight, if Oakland doesn't find a pick, if it's a clean team fight, it'll actually be Blacklist favored. But if it's a messy team fight where Oheb doesn't get to free hit and position in the back, AB Ren wins. Again, with this like, it's a battle of the compositions. That's why AP Brennan are trying to attack from different angles. You can see the way that they're tackling this team fight, right? Now. They're going yeah, from like literally different Fury, angles, just attacking everywhere, Fury, making it chaotic so that Oheb can position himself properly. And look at Ogren. 
Earth Shatter. Malay still being pushed. Top might be next. As yeah, Oheb is pushed all the way up top. You see that shit? Oheb's gonna be very aware, man. That's the wind talker. Three items. And AP Bren. I don't think they're in any rush. Guiding win. They still have some minion waves to handle, so good little uh, push there, top side from the members of Blacklist, Oheb and Renegade. Uh, someone needs to initiate first, and let's see who the main target here for AP Bren will be, and who the main target for Blacklist will be. Main target for AP Bren will be Oheb for sure. They gotta go for Oheb. Oh, oh, Oheb's free hitting, guys. Oh, look at Few. He's zoning Oheb. He's not letting Oheb off. He's not letting Oheb off. Few, 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 Few. Oh my God. Never mind. It doesn't even matter that Few is holding them in choke point. You see that? One good ult, and it changes everything, dude. One good ult. Holy shit. Dude, that ult was crazy. The sustain was too much. Few couldn't even handle him in the choke point. Oh my god. Bro. Jesus. That extra damage. Ridiculous. Welcome, welcome the question earlier, can this front line of Blacklist buy enough oh my time God. and make sure that Oheb gets a key? Awesome positioning with that full barrage. Ixia all better than Bea ult? By far, dude. If and Ixia gets like a, a big position, Ixia is safe in the back, that's, what, that's it. Like AP Bren needs to target Oheb. If they don't get Oheb, it's over. So far, Damn, this peel comp, them. this now this is literally just, this is a funnel oh. Ixia comp, guys. Shots. This is literally Ixia esports comp. This is a composition built just for, for Ixia. I they the are all the cover hero heroes. Faramis, Kaja, and Mathilda. Damn, Blacklist International with another innovative fucking draft, bro. Jesus. How do you get to the to Oheb at this point? How? How do you get to Oheb? Who can get to Oheb? Flap, but Flap gets melted too easily. Damn. We thought the jungle Kaja was troll. Turns out it is fucking genius. Wait, wait, don't go for fights though. You know, you gotta you gotta play with Ixia still. It's hyper carry, yeah, hyper carry meta, guys. It's hyper carry meta. It's literally just it's Oheb. If Oheb gets items, if Oheb gets gold, gold from the other team, they know they're goddamn. Multiple well played, man. Blacklist. Alive, right? so with that, this is again, Blacklist oh. International. They're innovation the by BLCK, by the code. It right now the code the, breakers. The spam there. He's got it. He knows it. And wait, they're looking for an angle, looking for a pull. All right, Blacklist playing this very, very carefully. If you brand need to respect it, the positioning and again the support and utility MTV special master the basics. He has they definitely oh. MTV is definitely and master the basics, in. man. Target gonna be flat. They get the last insanity out as uh -oh, well. Few. Sensui gets his buff. They force him back. They get a What do AP Bren do right AP now? Bren. Their composition is also a front to back, and you do AP not win front to back against Ixia. Need to so try to find like a flank, but even if they flank. How do they get Oheb, dude? There's a ah, the uh, they're so. It's over, guys. The next Lord comes up. It's luminous. Yeah. Isn't it over? Blacklist, Blacklist gets one game here for sure. Like, uh, they smell a different kind of wind. This time they're a little bit more comfortable, being a bit aggressive and a bit more forward. Whoa, DPZ. Retribution on Kaltizi actually uses Retri to try to get a slow on someone, but AP Bren aren't pulling the trigger just yet. There's a DPZ. Very defensive. There's a hair trigger reaction. Yeah. Really quick. Uh, a few already up to a uh, glowing wand as well. So How do they get Oheb? Means, this is the uh, question. Black How the fuck do they get Oheb? Coming out from that Lilia, who is actually our top damage leader of the game so far. And again, Oheb. We saw it in the last fight with that Lord being there. The placement, the positioning for him hmm. is so crucial here. And a well placed full barrage with the flicker available could change the tide of a fight in the skirmish here. And we see them get positioned for this Lord fight. All right. AP Brennan Blacks International going up for the scrum. They can reset, they can engage, or they can back off. Lord here pulled in by Count Easy. AP Bren leaning. Dude, this what they even do at this point? Like, oh, oh, oh. Info used, Bennett's Rage used by Super like, Marco. Whatever pick they try to go it's for, if it's not Oheb, it's useless. Blackest Look at this. Oheb is all. Oh, oh. Nah, gonna fuck push he's gonna AP Bren back a little wait, bit. Wait, 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 wait! Uh, have to be crucial with the positioning. Oh, Good flicker. Oh, there, there, you there you go. That's the last insanity. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oheb unkillable. When he was 1 HP, there's a cult alter. There's a guiding win. There is a Kaja. GG. Wow, well played, man. That won a draft. Wow. What a. Seriously, wow. This is. What a, what a draft. What a draft.
the Lord pit. I was born wow. in it. Wow, you wow, wow, wow. adopted the Lord pit. Right now, the six year old is in the black. Two one, guys, for sure. The there, there is no way for AP Bread to do anything against uh, this composition. Not once but twice. Like, even then, that was the best case scenario for Ogwen already. Like, if Ogwen got Earth Shatter and onward already against Oheb and they still wouldn't, were, was it, if they weren't able to get Oheb, it's, what, what, what can they do? It's over, guys. AP Bread should just, like, give this game over. Like, there's no, if they keep fighting like this, there's, there's no use. It's, they're just delaying the inevitable. Holy shit, what a draft. What a draft, bro. Wow, watch this draft. It doesn't matter, you're not gonna kill Oheb, bro. You can't, you can't, oh, wait. Dude, if I curse right Oheb there, now, that would be weird. Because <laughs> you're actually unkillable on this. Wait. Oh, Divine Judgment, dude. What a Divine Judgment. I think I canceled the decimation. Wait. 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 Blacklist International, situational awareness. They could have overcommitted. They could have forced the issue. They could have stayed to possibly end this game and get one on the There's no way AP Brand wins this. But they say, let's back on out of here. I smell something fishy. Ogwen popped the conceal. Could have found There's one. There's no way AP Brand wins this. Six K ahead. They have ruined AP Brand's base. The size of the coconuts on Blacklist International. Holy they shit. They were also low, but they still stayed. They still tried to uh, fight. Try to find a push, try to build a lead even more. Dude, all so. have full items already. Look at that. Like, I mean, dude, Marco's farming is ridiculous. What the fuck? Anyone really, but somehow, some way, and Win probability, honestly, this, this should be more 90 10%. Somehow, like 90 to 10. There's a very slim chance. There's. It's clear how? how the fact that there's so there's, much I don't see a way. Split push. Segway. It's not gonna happen. AP Brent are approaching this from a orthodox standpoint. But Blacklist, Dude, okay, there, there is one diaper. condition. If the Renner's Apathy can connect onto Oheb, and if they converse Oheb before the Cold Altar, before the Guiding Wind can help him, wow. then sure, yeah, they can win. Like, let's say, let's say, right? Renner Apathy, Earth Shatter knocking up the 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 Mathilda and the Ferimus, and then Kaltizi just decimates in, ults in, and then he gets Oheb. That will be their winning condition. And then they will go... At, at this late of the game, they can go for one straight push. But that, it's it's so, so like, it's so situational. That literally, everything has to happen exactly like that. It, it, that's how it has to play out. It has to play out exactly like what I just uh, said. Because if it doesn't, I, I really don't see how they, they're going to win in these Lord fights. Well, they can, if Kaltizi wins the Red Tree uh, on the Lord as well, that, that could work. They can push in. They have a pretty good siege comp, but Blacklist have really good defense, so it's like. Deal with and work around with as well, and they go to the dance. Super Marco, also positioned. Martis can't dive in because of Kaja ult. Well. That's why before. the Edith has to, to be the setup, Oakland's right? Like play. to to knock them up, and he has to get all three: Fairmis, Mar Mar uh, Fairmis, Kaja, and Mathilda. That's so fucking situational. That's it's more like um, more like a. That that's not gonna happen. Oh, Flap's doing trip, really well here. J, Flap, TZ, still healthy. He's the front of the line Ooh. for them. Has the immortality as well. Still if AP Bren together. win this, right. it is literally like the biggest Brand's skill diff, man. Because this draft, especially in the late game for Blacklist, no, should not be age. able to lose there's in team pull. fights. Flap, TZ's armor's gonna be down, yeah. and there's Ogwin with a conceal. They're gonna oh! that Sui. Super Marco finds the target. There's the Nero, though. Edward gonna jump in. Lord's still gonna be working. Oh my god, Marco. Oh my god. You got the Lord. Holy shit. Marco, 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 Marco! Oh wow, that was so fucking crazy. How the fuck did he survive for that long? Lord and 10. They're gonna let it fucking go. 30 seconds. I think it's endable for Blacklist. The Lord, what is he gonna spawn? It's gonna spawn mid. Oh, oh. Yeah, they're gonna let it go. They still have Oheb, it's very endable, man. 20 seconds. No. I don't think they can defend this, no? Yeah, the Lord just got cleared like that. 10 seconds for Marco. Full barrage, full barrage, few dead. No way. No way. GG. What? Wait. Do they have enough? Oh, Super Marco, Ogwin, no, no way. Up. Can they Wait, the base what here? the fuck? 
Do they call it? Do they get back? Or do they push it in for a game win? It's oh, over. Go for it. Forcing Super Marco back. Crystal going to be one Yeah, there you go. Utility Holy shit. Why National was it that X3? hard? Dude, Gren or... That was impressive. F How they kept the game till 20 minutes? Insurance. Blacklist wow. GG draft though. A what a draft. W draft from Blacklist, dude. What the fuck? Board. One to two. Well, they made it work. And they played to their strengths beautifully. G -G 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 -G. Two games now. That's what AP Brand did. Played to their strengths. MV3. Blacklist said, hey, it's the grand finals. We can do it too. Brand is so hard to finish? Yeah. yeah. They, dude, me, that was scary. That shouts, you are, but instead she's just shouting. Yes, <laughs> yeah, <she is>. you <laughs> are screaming, man. The screaming. The <laughs> all right. Well, Black is gonna need all the fuck was that the scream? You are. It's, it's a girl screaming. You are, right? This momentum. Am I wrong to say that this is Blacklist Age, uh, Blacklist International's first game win against AP Brand in all of the playoffs? In the playoffs, yes. Yeah. In the playoffs. Yeah. They were swept by AP Brand earlier. Here we go. All they took was Haji. Horse lineup, heed the call. Horse lineup. Makes me still wonder, like, and we'll, we'll Blacklist never horse. Know until maybe after. Chopped the roof and let the smoke clear. Wow. What was the one, baby. about from, you know, the, yeah, the coaches yeah. and, and everything else? Because. Oh, 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 it's bugging. You know, if it was me, I'd just say. It was All right. There you go. Two to one, boys. Mere bless done. Mere bless done. Not yet. What was my prediction for uh, my prediction for grand finals was Echo AP Bren and AP Bren wins four three. What happened to Echo? I don't know. Too many internal, uh, pro too many internal problems. Say it again. Boring Kaja Jungle. I will say it again because it was boring, bro. Was that not a boring game for the first fifteen minutes? It was a, it was a snooze snooze fest. Can't accept facts, nerd. <laughs> it was literally fucking boring early game. Because literally both of the teams were just were just farming. They, they couldn't do anything. And they were just giving everything away, right? Which is the, the strategy, but it was still boring, yeah. Say it again, it's boring, amazing pets. Nerd. <laughs> Blacklist have the best management? Yeah, maybe. I think, like, the... This this is proof, right? Like, with VYs, they were able to get to M, uh, M series, and without... Uh, v wise, they were still they're still able to get to M series. So it's not the players, rather it's the players and the management, because management is very very important. Man, having a a good environment to support the rest of the players, that's um, that's what like. That's what's good. Like that's you need both of those to be good. You can't just have good players and then horrible management. You can't just have good management and horrible players. Are you planning to stream both YouTube and Twitch? No, probably just on YouTube, man. The Kadamashi and Haji, yes, sir. And Miracle, remember me last stream said, "What if Blacklist goes Grand Finals without VYS?" Yep, they've proven that again. Like, they're just they're a championship team. They don't need. It's not just like VYS. It's not VYS being the championship players who are always able to bring Blacklist International to the like, internationals, but it's just the team, I guess. With this full like. Well, I wouldn't say full change, but they changed their jungle and their roamer, the two most vital like parts of their comp. Blacklist have physical and mental mental really? Do they have physical and mental Do they actually have like physical and mental coaches? Onyx also have physical and mental coaches, man. So it's teams with, with like these uh all these extra facilities who are always like so consistent, huh? Who's your team to? No, I don't know, man. Was that draft on Blacklist? Was a misclick or trolling? Definitely not trolling, man. They won. And they, they, they definitely had that strategy written down. Like, they, they had that strategy prepared. Alden recharge a guy who buy 1 million diamonds. Alden recharge... What? KDA, not Kada. I call it Kada. It's the Kada machine, bro. Coach Ducky versus Coach Yeb. That'll be fun. We already saw Coach Ducky versus Coach Yeb in, in SPS, right? But we'll see it again, I guess, in M5. Any info on how PH can get the team stats? I'm planning to replicate it. Team stats? What do you mean by team stats? 
See you soon. Gonna be M5 champ. Ooh, that's tough, man. MPL PH is competitive. MPL ID is entertaining. Both, I mean, MPL ID was very competitive as well. It's just Onik that's not competitive. Onik is not, not, not a team. They're just they They already won. I think everybody knew. I said it earlier. Like I said it before season twelve even started. This season twelve belonged to Onik. Like that. Uh, this MPL wasn't a competition uh, amongst like for champion. It's the competition for second place. There was only one slot that people were fighting for. Onik already got the the trophy when the season started. Before the season started. Echo is a definition of poor management, great players, and TNT is a great management and poor players. Really, I don't know. I don't think it's. It, do you, is that is that real? Is that true? Do you guys agree with that? Sensu is the perfect and the only one who can replace Wise in that jungle. His retries, man, that first turtle retry, that steal, crazy. Your honest view on Homeboy's chance in M five? I think Homeboy's will do pretty good. I, I I always like the teams who have never been to the M five stage, who've never been to the world stage. Their first world stage of our, like performance should be really good usually, because like they they have not they don't have any pressure you know. Meanwhile, if it was like like blacklist, blacklist had so much pressure coming into M four. They were defending champs. They were literally champions of MPL PH. Even at M three, they were coming in with a lot of pressure because it was in their first international, right? They played in MSC as well. They 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 lost to Execration in the grand finals and then they won again MPL PH. So like yeah, the teams who've been to internationals they usually have a tougher, tougher like road because there's so much pressure on them because everybody's already looking at them. It's e it's easier to get to the top to climb to the top than staying at the top, guys. And that's why it's very impressive for like teams who are able to consistently be at the top, especially when it's like an especially like orgs with ch changes, a lot of changes. Best retro user of all time. I don't know who the best retro user of all time is, man. But right now, I think it's Ensui. I'm excited to see Kyrie versus Ensui. They both played for Onik PH and Blacklist. Ooh, you're right. You're right. One one went from Blacklist to Onik PH, Kyrie, and then one went from Onik PH to Blacklist and Sui. That's that's a good uh, storyline. That's a, that's very cool. Blacklist must have been in the same position with Echo. Renegade is not supposed to play season twelve. Kimpo is the first choice for the Rome position? Really? Didn't know that. I thought Renegade was already in, like, um, the, yeah. Brent is back on M World. What is your thought? Um, th they're good. I predicted them to be, um, champs and to go to M5. I expected, uh, Bren. I think the, the more interesting <coughs> question would be, what do you think about Blacklist making it back to M5? I think it's crazy. They revamped their roster after MSC, so it wasn't like it wasn't like they had two seasons to prepare. They had literally one season to prepare this new roster, and they're able to do it with players who were, I would say, pretty pretty fucking bad at the start of this, like before the season preseason. Rena J, I don't care if you're a Blacklist fan, if you're a Rena J fan, you need to be able to admit that Rena J preseason before season twelve started. He was bad, like really bad. The fact that he improved so much shows you that, again, this player ain't a fucking bitch. A lot of players, they get hate, they play, they play bad, and then they just, they just, their careers disappear. Players like this, the guys who get like bashed, the guys who get doubted and they come back, they use that as motivation. That, that's, that's a real championship player. That's a player that will go, that will, that has potential. The players who just, who get hated a bit, who get criticized a bit and then just lose out on everything, lose their mental, they're never going to be champ anyway. So it's like, yeah, whatever. The um, Mirko, off topic, do your glasses have anti-red? What's anti-red? Anti-glare? I think it does have like anti-glare. So it's like, yeah, I don't know. Why do you only have once? This is I did not shave. This is this is how my fucking mustache grows, bro. It's just fucking Chinese genes. <laughs> anti radiation, yeah. Oh, I, yeah. I, it has anti radiation. Yeah, that's what happened as soon as he found out. But you see, th that's what's impressive, man. 
a lot of players when they find out they're not main five, they will they they'll just be like, fuck, what the hell? Uh, all right then, you know, I'll just keep playing normally. But Renna J is like, no, I'm I'm going to work hard. I want to be part of this team. I want to be, I want to be. Yeah, he has ambitions, bro. He he works hard for it. So really, W Renna J. This guy is so I have so much respect for him after. His whole, like, fucking story arc, basically. He went through a whole character arc. He already went through an entire character arc as an XP laner, the hitman. And now he went through a full character arc again to be a good roamer, man. W player. Yeah. No, that's why it's so impressive. Renegade still has hunger. He's, a, he's, not a, he's not, like, a young player. It's not his first season. He's been here for a while. I've seen his name for so many, like, so many times I've seen his name. I've just never seen him in the international stage, right? Oh, they're talking about something interesting. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. Sabihin na natin may mga Falcon Esports members mula sa kila Ken, kila Justin, at pati na rin uh, wala si Hero Flash though. doon. Si Ruby Didi. Ayun, si Ruby Didi. Pero yung Burmese Ghouls na makikita natin ngayon ay hindi na yung Burmese Ghouls na nakasanayan natin o yung nakita natin during the M2 World Championship. Bagong Burmese yeah, dude, Bren na, and Burmese Ghouls dito. both made it uh, back to M5. Si That'll be si fun. Carbon, the si Bren versus Burmese Ghouls si matchup. Rematch. Si Blink ang kailangan nating tutukan dahil sabihin na natin itong si Blink ay bihasa sa mga utility junglers pero hindi natin pwedeng kalimutan ang kanyang pinaka about BG na Ruby Rose. I don't hindi actually watch a lot of uh, I don't watch I didn't watch BG uh, at all. Didn't watch the Myanmar qualifier so I don't know how good they are. From time to time. Thank you so much Astro Zan for the 40 uh, rupees I believe that is. Much appreciated Astro Zan. Thank you so much man. At pati na rin ang mga utility na supports. Pero bukod sa utility supports ay utility junglers din ang kanilang So, it's their meta as well. Look at that. Rafael Yo, is Blink just just Beloisky? Except for the Estes and Florin. He's just Beloisky, dude. Ruby, Rafaela, and Matilda. Bro's Beloisky. Burmese Beloy. Blink is... Look at his hero pool. Literally the same, dude. Oh, even their mid laner. Yo, even their mid laner is a boy. Their XP lane is Luke. They all have the same heroes. What the hell? Yo. <laughs> it's Geek Fam. <laughs> Hindi naman talaga biro ang makapasok sa Bro, it's Geek Fam! So, Geek Fam, Burmese Geek Fam! Uh, respetuhin ang Burmese Ghouls kahit What the heck? bagong mukha ang mga nakikita natin. Yan ang ating naging M5 vibe check. Umuli ako nga pala si Umi at ibabato na tayo kay Odin. Always on the way! This is oh wait, Odin cosplaying Matilda. Matilda! Together with me is SJ of WCS. Burmese fam. Burmese fam. You're so beautiful. How many co- Dude. How many cosplayers are And do we have a Melissa cosplayer? <laughs> Blood is not Matilda. Wait, is that not Matilda? That is Matilda, right? Wait. That is Matilda, right? Yo, thank you so much for the donation. Astro Zan, much appreciated. That long microphone, yeah. <laughs> Ruby Didi was in the Team Miracle Curse. Yeah, Mythic Seal. Ruby Didi was in Mythic Seal. MPL skin, yeah, it is Matilda. Volume kind of low. It is low because we're talking right now. We're, we're just chatting. And I don't understand Tagalog, so... Like, I... I don't understand Tagalog, so, yeah. Waiting for Mirko Nobara. 100k subs, man. It's not gonna happen. It's not. How, how many subs do we have right now? It's not gonna happen, bro. 100k subs by the end of the year. We are at 55k. Nah. It ain't gonna happen. It ain't. Is there any slot for PH for wildcard? No, they already get two slots for M5 instantly. Same goes for Indo. No, no wildcard slots. Do you like new skin M5? Dude, the Prime Yu Zong skin looks so good. I think it's good. Do you guys, do you guys like the, the Prime Yu Zong skin? Boys, 100k subs, easy. <laughs> Can you actually cosplay when casting? No. No. I don't think so. It's so good, yeah. It looks, it's, it looks so good. Mirko. Sophia, I don't... I don't really like follow any of it, so it's like I don't know. I don't. I don't. I literally do not know what's going on. I only know that they're at war. Are you going to dye your hair red and black because Geek made it to M5? 
No, that that bet was if they won MPL ID. If they won MPL ID, I would go black and, and red for uh, Geek Fam colors. Don't predict Onik or Geek on M5. <laughs> Mirko cosplaying Tigreal? Nah, Ghani should cosplay Tigreal. He has the he has the Tigreal look. I have the... What do I... What? I don't know. Predictions for LFC versus NFO? What the fuck is LFC and NFO, bro? I'm sorry, I don't know. Legit. Do white hair? Yeah, white... White hair would be cool. Silver hair would be good. Cosplay Alucard? Nolan? Ooh, Nolan. Natan look? You have Alu hairstyle? You're Gushin? Arlet? Arlet, Arlet has long hair, bro. See, his hair is like down to here. You can do Dairoth human form. Do Sukuna? Dude, I actually had pink hair. And I actually like... Yeah, let's see if I can find it on my IG. Wait, I'll try to find it, guys. It's very old, though. Popo and Mirko. Popo and Kupal. No, Bara cosplay? If I... Guys, the... Okay, so I made a... I made a bet, technically, with my subscribers, right? If we get 100k subs by the end of the year... That means before 31st of December, or on 31st of December, before 1st of January, we will cosplay Nobara from Jujutsu, but it's not gonna happen, dude. We're at 55k and it's already October, dude. We have two months to get a hundred, to get 50, 45k subscribers. Nah. It could be. Everything for OHEB and overload for utility support? Maybe. Well, we'll get the answer eventually. Who's your champion in M5? We don't know yet. We'll see. We'll see. I'll have a prediction video out. Be the next smart game face of the day winner. Just flash the hashtag power of smart on your devices in the in a green background. Put your game face on to How about 60k cosplay? Nah, it's 100k. All right, okay. Oh, 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 so <laughs> Guess it with the pink hair before with Mara, LaFell, and Butters. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did. That was at MSC. What do you call those things? The hearts. The hearts. And the flying kisses. At this point, man. Smart face of the day is. Gotta be more aggressive. All right, all right. Did you watch Echo vs. Blacklist? Did I? Uh, no, I didn't watch Echo vs. Blacklist. Who won Game Face of the Day? Tell the Filipino towns to advertise your channel so you reach 100k. No, stop. Stop. Wait, is Bonchan drafting, guys? Has Bonchan been drafting? Wait, I want to check. Has Bonchan been drafting or no? Oh my goodness, nice you're doing it again. What? <laughs> no, it's MTB. <laughs> MTB, yeah? Please react to those games. Which games? Yeah, we'll try. Mirko from MHA cosplay. Bro, I do not have the ass to pull off Mirko from MHA. Oh, yo, 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 yo. I don't mind. I was just holding it up. <laughs> Anyways, talking about the Philippines versus the world, folks, let's talk about gold laners. Yeah, as we look at the gold laners right now. Okay, top picks uh, to compare Beatrix and the Claude, actually, uh, for Super Marco. High win rates at that. The Irithan and Bruno for Oheb, very clear. Uh, Bruno and Irithel for Marky, we saw that especially in MPL ID Season 12 playoffs. Resolution. And the Carry and Ixia, actually, for Kusei. I love the I love it when the Ixia does come out. Mm -hmm. It's not I, I feel like it's not something that you consistently pick up, obviously. Uh, but because it is so glass cannon like we mentioned. But like the previous game where we needed, you know, to see something from Blacklist International where it changed the pace of things, I think that was the right answer. Is it the final Ube? That I don't know. I don't right. know if that is. Given that for AP Brenda bounce back is again the momentum is currently swinging in the direction of Blacklist International. But I'd say you'll be the drafter in MPLI. Deep, deep, ah, maybe okay. Take a page out of uh, Kusei's book here. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, field the carry. If they find a way to put the carry. Yo, in, like, what's up, Kensu? How you doing, Kensu? That might be it. Welcome back. Again, a lot of the marksmen today. How are you are doing, Kensu? Just 
you know. Drop the oh, roof and let the smoke clear. Why not using CW stats? Yeah, I guess they wanted to use Marky's stats. Maybe because it, it emphasizes their point uh, a bit more uh, about Bruno and Irithel. I think because if you put CW stats, it'll just be like 90% win rates for everything. <laughs> Probably. Because Onik just won everything. What can I say about the biggest snub in MLBB? Venus? What do you, what do you mean biggest snub in MLBB? What does that mean? It's all for oh, it's Kusei Filipino. It's Kusei Filipino as well. Wait, Kusei is Filipino? I didn't know Kusei was Filipino. I thought like I know Marky, Marco, and Oheb are Filipino. Kusei is Filipino. Oh, Kusei is Filipino. Which team was he in, guys? What the fuck? I didn't know. My bad, G. I think from RSG. Oh. Wow. Stretch the envelope going into game four. Black is on the oh, draft, draft, draft. Draft the roof and let the smoke clear. OPH, okay. And the box shot so far. It's yeah, Kosei. It's ah, yeah, I remember Kosei. I don't remember that see. name being pronounced or being spelled that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember I Kosei. The first two picks. They'll take out the Edith here. You're not going to first pick Faramis. RG Kosei. But if they yeah. do, that just really goes to show how important this pick is for them. K O U S E I, right? The, now the it's Kusei. By the way, we have to acknowledge okay, those yeah. two legends on your screen that just passed Venus by. Venus was snub in top legends. ten nominee greatest player and in MLBB. Wait, was Venus not nominated for top ten greatest players in MLBB for PH? That's right. The big wins by a Seabull would not have happened this year if not for their support. Now going into the first phase. The Nolan, first pick, Fanny, there, Choi Matilda, against Zobin, AP Bren. Valentina, first pick Faramis, again for Blacklist. They pick up Faramis. Haji Faramis. He's the pick. He Super is the prior one. for them. Confirmed. Confirmed. Let's see how they handle it. I was not nominated? Uh, Who was nominated? Novaria Valenti. Oh wait, no, no. It has to be one of those two. What? And that's the question, right? Where do we see this? How do I see this? Yeah, I, you know, while we wait for that, I'm curious. If was there any glaring things for you guys that really changed with? Where do I see this, guys? Haji alone. Uh, top ten players the award from the previous game. Mm, Haji, so much, to be honest. Benny, uh, I feel like we did Edward, more of a Yowie. Uh, that's just from my perspective, because it still looked like black. You could have covered up the name, and I would have believed. Wow. That was you went. Yeah. All right. Uh, personally, for me, I am of the belief wow. that Yue is more aggressive, and Haji reads the room a little better, plays the map more, okay. and the map demanded you protect Oheb. Yeah. He played that role to a T. Okay. And there's no Carl TZ? Oh, Satsui finally gets his hands. Wait, you, there's no VYs the and there's Akai, no Carl. At least one of the and utility what? junglers. Look at here. this. The, the switch up. Like, if there's no. Coach Ducky decided to get Whoa. the Martise That's over weird. the Akai. Yeah, which was interesting to me because they're up against a Faramis, and usually when there's a Faramis on the opposing side, you. Oh, Carl is in there. All right, so it's the next the, the next slide. Okay, so they have, there is Carl so in the next slide. I checked one slide. A bit differently here. Few Carl TZ Rebo. Okay. Few Carl TZ Rebo is in. They can go gold lane, pressure the gold lane pickups, going to the second well, they're, phase. Well, technically they haven't revealed everyone, guys. One, two, three, four. Again, easier dive. Five, six, seven. They only revealed seven. There's top. There's ten, right? They've only revealed seven, guys. But don't forget, there is still For sure, viewers will be available. in. No way, guys. They've only revealed seven. What? Valentina. It's top ten ah, players award, right? right? Nominees. Pick up the, Valentina now. the greatest ten player award. The play of Blacklist there's only seven, guys. So there's yeah. three more. So, yeah. No, I mean, Blacklist has no room for it. They yeah. only have the Faramis. No, I meant like um, that Blacklist wants AP Brand. It's like, hey, we don't have... Right, Valentina, Valentina, Mathilda, Mathilda Martis. Still, still the same. It. Okay. Kind of comp. Yeah. Could be. Could they picked the Valentina against the Faramis and the Akai. This time around... Yeah, that, that's pretty down the wire. There's only seven that's from Indo 2? Oh, close, shit. Okay. So I don't know about that. What the heck? Uh, no significant. Oh, wait. There's a slight significant, uh, slight edge <laughs> for AP Pren for the overall damage that their composition can uh, do. Is it just for active players? Now, but of course, I guess, yeah. I guess all the players who are there are active. Still begs the question, too. What do you put in the gold lane, right? Uh, for the most part, this series, anyway, yeah. uh, there's been a lot of attention to the gold lane from both teams. Yeah, you know, no. uh, let's protect them. Let's let them let do the, do ah, it off themselves. I see. You know, how that do they do that? Game three was almost unlucky. single handedly won by a gold laner. Exactly. So there you go. The, the chat has answered the question. I won't read it out loud. So in that case, he is the one. Brody Ban, Ixia Ban. They gotta take this out now, man. Blacklist. Ixia so busted. The All right, that's cool. I like it. They they, they read it the situation. Yep. And Blacklist. What do they go for now? What ban? Really need to ban out the Clint here. 
because uh, if they're taking away the X here, then the Clint is the last best possible option in terms of like artillery, a little bit more right. uh, way in the back gold laners. So that would leave. Okay, if this is a well. I just said a Clint. Out. That's a Clint ban inside of Black. Bruno ban. Bruno ban now from AP Bren. Irithel and Claude. Brody, Bruno, Iksha, Ban. Yeah, the Irithel, yeah, Beatrix, Claude. Bad we haven't seen Claude at all this Clint series. Good right now for AP Bren. Claude would be... Yeah, there's a lot of uh, dive right now for Blacklist. Uh, the dive would it be solid? Too heavily they already have a very good early game with yeah. Nintendo, the Valentina, uh, and um, zone, maybe even Flicker combo. Martis. They need but a bit more range. The Clint makes more it, sense. But, but if they want to go for just more dive and that late game presence... What black and just more survivability. Is Technically, a Claude could work. Looking for a new way. Looking for a new way. Yeah, like Rumor has want, it as well that VYs are both sitting this season out due to suspension. Ah. Like, yeah, for, you know, uh, they kind of want to force him okay. to have those initiations and be a little more aggressive. And uh, with the first three picks that they have, and they could make that happen. Ban. All right, they're setting up for another. Band, they're though, setting up for Oheb, man. No Yuzong, no oh. Diver. They're still protecting Oheb. They're still yeah. protecting Oheb. Does yep. this mean that Good they one. want them to pick up also the Exborg, which has been the answer for the Terizla for the most part? Uh, Exborg would be very good this scenario, game against the Akai against the Terizla. This time Exborg would be really solid. The Benedetta at this point would be difficult, Paquito. Yeah, I think Blacklist just forced AP Bread into picking up the uh, Exborg, <laughs> but the Uranus is still okay here, honestly. Yeah, no, if I may, from game three, yeah, the Exborg was kind of underwhelming. If yeah. you don't get the full on last insanities, or you get your Firag armor popped before you're ready, mm -hmm. that's it, nothing. You done? Do they pick up the Irithel away uh, first? They pick up yeah. The okay, so now the Clint. They want pick the Irithel away. Now Black. Now Oheb. What is what yeah, is this hero open? now? No Ixia, no Brody, no Bruno. Ooh. The Angela is still Beatrix. open. So if AP Brent's one one decides, one one Angela. Angela in one one Angela could work. One one combo with Angela. <laughs> Might, might one one Kaja could because, work as well, uh, technically. Or they go quad, oh, yeah. all right. Uh, Good matchup the against the Irithel. An okay, like uh, a matchup that can win work. Well, Final pick, Rene J. Kaja? Let's see. Rome for Rene Kaja Rene would be solid against this comp. They need Wait, some lockdown. I was going to say, what if they did take up the Angela? But they go okay. Angela, okay. Uh, I mean, you blacklist. Yeah. Expected. So, I was talking about AP Brent. Oh, okay. Well, well, Claude Angela is a good combo, right, too. Right, right, right. The Aerithel is actually going to struggle in lane if Angela comes in to oh, heal yeah, the Claude continuously. I, now I got excited. But there's also a, a, a Matilda. You played yourself. This is just a different pattern from what we've seen for, for a while. What does AP Brent go Benedetta. for, sir? Yeah, it has to be damage or split, anything. Oh, excuse me. Our lot. Right. Oops. There it is. Damage and CC. How about it? In a side hmm. of sustainability, balances out a little bit. I think more it might be this. This again, draft is a is 50 50. No, guys, play style, game four. This might be blacklist equali equalizing the series, guys. Scaling much better right now, statistically. Go and vote However, in the comment section Angela right now, guys. Blacklist well versus AP Bren, AP game number like. four. Are we gonna get game number seven? Question mark. I don't know. Are we scaling team fighting that burst that they have? They might fall into the trap of just losing their map. If, if that happens. If that yeah. happens. But so far, the problem in game three was... We're a long time fan. I'd like to ask you if this, if the same uh, squad of casters are coming again. I think so. Yes. I think Simp. one of the things here, too... We want game seven? Whether yeah. What they've learned, Oh, no game face yet. Game games. face after this. Game the face, game face. Blacklist International. The game face? There you go. Momentum on their side. Game face. We'll, we'll do. This we'll do Oheb. Actually works really right, well. Let's Oheb. Biggest well, factor that I have that. that I always. Let's go. Don't like to point game out. Game four, it, baby. The case. Claude takes a while. Yep. He's got to build up. It's all in again. It's all. This looks like a high action one. game. It's all on Oheb. Blacklist looking to even the Maybe score. not though. Maybe the Akai this just gets all the four. neutral objectives. Right. I think it should be high action both. with Martis no, versus Akai. Early to mid game. AP Bren. Mid to late game. Blacklist International. But if Blacklist wants to play a little bit faster, then they can do so through. Ooh, no, I thought they get that. If, uh, if they can get the Claude out early, if they can get a good timed, ro a well timed rotation uh, uh -oh, of the to take down the Earth. Oh. Yep, that's the Retri forced out of uh, Sinsui. Something to wow. know, gentlemen. Look at this killing spree. Oh, oh that's a good reset yeah. by Ogwen, though. And, uh, on the side of that's a good reset. That's wilderness blessings Sensui won't be able to do two, two waves, wild. and you already used that Retri. That delays that's it. Fast. That delays Bless. Sensui by quite a bit, like. man. This is uh, quite some work as well from Ogwen. Um, but good, good, know, good again, work by Ogwen, man. Early kind of aggressive. He's happy the finals wasn't a sweep. Yeah, by both teams it'll be sad if, it's a, if it was a sweep, huh? Edge if they can pull it off. 
Yep. We're looking What's at, the score? 2-1. Uh, Baby Brent 2. Coming up in about 30 Black seconds. One. We can expect a few more rotations from our junglers. Sensui we just about to get his orange. So it's clear where this 200, 200 something gold lead from Baby Brent's coming from. First minute of the game. Yeah. There was something actually pointed out by our analysts earlier. Uh, that Edward for the first two games took a little bit. Uh oh, Edward. Or, wait. Yo, he's Whoa. dead. Wow. Nice mortal well, coil, that Kyle. He's gonna get hurt out of that. As he wow. Falls early well played. On. 30 That's free seconds turtle. Should be no heavy spin as well I'm from Sensui. Sure free turtle. Yeah, nope. It's yeah. been 30 seconds this whole time, <laughs> given that we are at the turtle, which yeah. spawns at two. There you go. Are, have you heard of something called the caster curse? The caster curse? <laughs> what is that? You had to mention it, and it immediately happens. That was me. That was, uh, yeah, that was me. That was us. That was us. That was that, yeah, that was we. And right now, this is a turtle. Just going to the hands because of everything. Mm -hmm. Curse or not, AP Bren gets that first turtle pretty much free. Okay. So the point I Instead of reading it as AP Bren, that, uh, it's just simply read it as AP, as, as App Bren. Doesn't would, sound good. Uh, Sounds fucking go stupid. App Bren? AP Bren. Uh, but now that he has an Angela with him. Simpler doesn't, yeah, it doesn't always mean better. With just flickering penalty zoning uh, through his, with his heart's content. Yep. So AP Brent acknowledging that actually made their first major rotation to try and take down Edward. So that was the right call. So they are he still part really of Hall of Legends ah. as the biggest thorn on their side in the early to mid. That's the biggest thing stopping them from snowballing. Which kind of makes sense why Kyle TZ is so gung-ho on picking the Martise. I mean... Martise is what? At best here, 1.5 coming in. I think you're going to want to go for Sensui at least. Just whittle him down a little bit. Few also holding on. The clock is stuck. Yeah, spin. the clock is stuck yeah. at 30. Actually like this. It's this, already, uh, well, first turtle was few, two minutes already, so we're at like three minutes. This game. Um, get the heavy spin over the nether realm because instead of matching the nether realm, you take them out of position, negate pa the effect of brand. them sticking together. <laughs> Disperse. Disperse them. Then destroy. As I was saying, the decimate kind of deals with the I feel like UF fits this lineup better than Haji, the but they, they won with Haji right just last game. Yeah. It was 2 0, and then oh, Haji joined. All right, here we go. Red is uh oh, wow. Yeah, good good damage. That good dive. Like it. Nice circling Marco, eagle. Getting a kill here. Now they're planning themselves. AP Brand with the early the game, man. Solid jungle. early. Yep. Again, just make it so oppressive here difficult with this comp. Especially to have kind of a relaxed game. Aerithel gets a good matchup against the Claude. Then with Ogwen getting that kill. It's a cut by Flap as well. Other play style wants to be early to mid scaling. Let's see how deep they are going to go into trying to taking this purple buff away from Sensei. This purple buff, like, this purple buff invade is more so to just try to bait out the heavy spin, man. If they can bait out the heavy spin, it's free turtle. Yes. But no, they, they're not yeah. able to. They don't want to commit. Gotta be here. Uh, commit onto that. Remember, they're gonna pull they the turtle. Just went, get better position. Thirty-second game, two kills already. Super crazy thirty-second game, they guys. Be able to fight through it with this mark is now they're gonna fight it out for the turtle here. Second one of the game. AP Brent full force. It one v one. One v one. One v one. Oh, never doubt Sensui's red tree, bro. And gets out of there. Blacklist is Oh, especially on an Akai. Literally, just Sensui can do that. Folks, yes. name something more iconic than Sensui. His Sensui, Akai and stealing away turtles Sensui Retri, bro. Of the At this team. point, you know turtles, what's fucked when you, it's and not even surprising still. anymore. That's Double how good four. he is. Oh, now oh, everybody oh, just oh, knows oh, that he's that good. Back. God, God damn. Now here to help out. Sensui. Notice how much work Oheb is doing in overdrive. He's Sometimes he's managing two lanes the best he can. Yep. But Super Marco, because he got that early kill, has also helped keeping it pretty much even. Economy wise, it's about a minute and a half until the next turtle spawns. Since you retreat, always sensational for yep, sure. Two turtles in 30 seconds, PH easy. macro is on a different level. Yeah, Th two it's turtles in 30 Edward's seconds, bro. Uh, MPL PH is Edward on a different to, level objective wise. Uh, I've never seen any other team get two turtles in the first 30 oh, seconds. That's the they can even oh, that whoa, what that damage. Mean to use the flicker Jeez. Oh, that was a blunder, or just get preemptive by Yo, Flappy. Marco and Oheb level seven, seven in 30 seconds. By the way, one First turtle in 30 uh, seconds, guys. Yo, MPOPH yeah, it's actually, it's actually is crazy with it, man. Uh-oh. You Filipinos play the game differently. Oh. For few here. Heart guard along with the blazing duet. Two. Few oh, my God. He's dead as fuck. That's a dead panda. What flicker was that? Oh, you can see the reaction on Q. He's like, ah, my bad. I flickered to the wrong. I flickered to the wrong side. You see that, guys? Huge final slash going to come through. Haji has that nether realm to help him out. of it, despite a great placement with the final slash from Flap Interesting. AP Bren moving forward, moving back. 
Wasn't sure exactly is it my problem or is the game at, at 30 seconds? Yes, it is 30 smash. seconds. It, 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 oh, 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 we're back. He what he was trying to do. Time he jump. To joke Black's International. He yeah. tried to flicker on backwards. Yeah, I, he was <laughs> 50 minutes to, earlier? I feel like he was just trying to get a bit of damage off before he went down. If ever he could have gotten a combo off, but at that point, nah. That too. Yeah. But at that point, it was just way too much to handle for, for AP four Brand. members of Black. <laughs> okay, APB. Let's see how they're gonna be playing this, cause get a little bit more comfortable into the side. Player goal to Marco number one Bench still. Macos, which is the right He's choice. a farmer, dude. Well, He's the Filipino he's farmer. That the That's what Super Marco is. <laughs> the Filipino farmer. So good at farming, dude. It, uh, Damn, that damage though as well. He's not just a farmer. He's a farmer and a fighter. He's the he's the he's the triple F. The Filipino farmer fighter. Triple F. Not gonna be close enough. That all goes in the hands of Kyle Teasy. They've got the two Super Marco triple F. Blacklist win Game is wild one. from time freeze so to time skip. How does the next big objective fight go, and what do they find before it? It's about two minutes until the Lord Photo is built on both sides. Logan and Renegade. I'm your Kang. What's up? Sprint on OHM. So Good lane swap, man. Right before flap. Item he check. Haas Claws yeah, Berserker should be going for GDS yeah, next, but he can also go for Respect down. One, or he could just go for moves. more pen against the. Priority. Very tanky frontliners uh, yeah, with uh, Melfic Roar. It delays the damage output, so it sort of delays your snowball factor uh, on the side of AP Bren. But I think for them now, they're, uh, they aren't... Are you pure Indo, Mir Kang? Technically, name. I am One born Indo. I'm an Indo citizen, but like race-wise, I'm Chinese. The That's right. Uh, right now, they, they made the call and say, you know what? You're going to be utility. You're going to be getting heavy spin anyways. Yep. Yeah. So play the role. You may need that too, obviously, with what they're up Free against. Free turret. Uh, Maybe Ben, dude, board. the way they utilize but leads with all that, is, be happy is so good. Getting this turret, they'll make their way now to the next one. We're still a minute away from the lore. What is this? Flap Teasy and Ogwin taking control of the bush. Coming in, oh. final slash. They're trying to bait out that, 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 that uh, uh, heavy Again, spin, man. A lot of this is just kind of pushing and pulling. Can you speak Chinese? No, Not really I am a fake Chinese. Though, I can only, I only look Chinese. Keep going. <laughs> what you call the business, a faint, a bait. F-E-I-N-T. Thank you for spelling that out. I almost forgot how to do that. Some people might think F-A-I-N-T. That's a different kind. Yeah. You know, that's the not fun kind, unless you're into that. <laughs> no one's into that. No one's into that. No. That's sure uh, I'm going to well, be on the plane I during M5 that. Grand Finals? So oh, no. Park. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Don't start singing it. Miss you, Chester. Back to the action, folks. Mid lane pressure by AP Bren. 1.6K gold lead. Lord spawning in just five seconds. I'd say 50 50, unless. Ooh, they oh, they a oh. DPZ. Another one. DPZ. Lord's up. Those, uh, Do you have a convenience store? No. Final slash. Final slash will come back quicker. Oh, Let's Sensui. Watch out for the green Good chunk. Good poke, man. Flap Teasy just sitting on Sensui for now. Circle oh, good damage on Edward as well. Doesn't Yo, have this poke is needs. actually Does ridiculous. Edward's dead. Wait, Edward's oh. dead. Oh. Flap Teasy will get the kill. Harkar going to be used on OM oh, as well. Still going to be for this Lord. AP Bren with the numbers advantage. Going to be pushed back a little bit. Super Marco quite low as well. Blacklist International has great fighting potential here. Can they pull through? Q still has Watch Netherrealm. Marco does not have an ult. And they're dashing into the back. Oh my dashing god. Into the back. Australian Leo is not real. Teasy once again going to force him there. Ogwin with the circling eagle. Still going to be fighting. Sensui, 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 Sensui. Keep him at bay. Oh! oh Marco! Marco! We'll secure the Lord. Flap Teasy gets the stuns off. Marco! But still going to be chasing him down. The, the Filipino farmer fighter. The triple F. Oh! oh. Edward, Edward. Pop it up, pop it up, pop it up. Goes in with the penalty zone. Can't fight Super Marco though. All has gone. Hodges Holy quite shit, what a fight, dude. What a fight, dude. And now it's Kyle Kyle's Teasy. getting out. He's getting tied up. Oh my goodness. The team. goodness. They're happy Gracious. with it. They got the Lord. Few for that ended with a one for OHM one. For few. That's a trade. And a Lord. Take wow. Twice on Mr. Sunday. Recchiano. We didn't have the award just yet in season six, but it was unanimous. Everyone saw Flap Teasy as uh -oh, a rookie uh -oh, uh -oh. of the season. It's Chase of that again. Oh, since, since it gets out. Well played. Tanky enough to take all wow. of it. And still live, but right now Super they still Marco. have to get back, heal up, and get ready for this Lord pushing in. The Filipino cannon has been let loose, and so far, all wow. throughout that minute of action, Flap is so good. Farmer fighter, you mean Viking? Yes, that's what Super Marco is. He is a farmer fighter. Oh wow! Okay, looking at the gold. Flap's Arlet. Flap is dude. The whole team is really good. But the combo. 
of the Angela. Look at Flap, look at Flap. What sends Super Marco back at that fight? Oh. Flap again! Flap TZ once again. Pressing the situation. Got the tier but twos and bottom and mid. The tier two and bottom, top, sorry. And bottom. And now they make their way down the mid. The Filipino cannon. Ah, Mr. Cannon. His moniker, I was thinking of it. But we called him the Filipino oh. oh! Again! Yeah, my. Unleashing here. No. A huge threat. Now, oh, we're going to jump in with the penalty zone. We're just trying to keep Blaze him at bay. Cancel! Oh, Kyle! Kyle! Kyle. Oh, what a cancel! Oh, no. Holy shit! Kyle Teasy gets what, the a kill. Oh, what a cancel! What a cancel! As they put Yo, the pressure Kyle on Black Teasy with, with the fucking Avery cancel on Mortis. Those are two key oh my god, players. did you guys see that? These two players in Yo! The, AP Bren the straight knockup, bro. Mid. That's Still a buy one, go. get one Let's special, go. bro. Slash again. You got all him and Renegade. And they can't push Kyle on TC. forward. But AP Brent right now is dominating. Take it back. 35k gold lead. God damn, AP Brent, stop. This is stop it. Two world championships, Flap TZ. Boy, did oh, not have man. a cool on the Black Dragon form in Singapore. Wow, you saw it here, non-stop. Final wow, slash after wow, wow, final wow. slash, making the most out of the stun initially from that Arlot and the sweeping anyone. Blacklist International are just, they just keep getting caught off guard. It's like, he's not gonna, oh, he did? Oh, he's not gonna, oh, he did again? <laughs> Bet you believe Blacklist wish they had at least one Purify. Whew. Yeah, they're wishing they had well, that one Purify. Not just the final slash, fam. Call Angela Even isn't the same as Irithal Angela. Hush, it really hush, isn't, hush. yeah. But it's still... The full proc. That's why I thought what? maybe they would go for something like Akaja, just to go for more yeah, lockdown. The Angela the hasn't yeah, been right. too, like, crazy this game. Cool. The Angela pick, sell, not Renegade. Thank the, you. The pick. Count Easy also <laughs> very clutch with maximizing his uh, his control abilities as well. Especially Can you cast the next team fight? And... Should Trinity I cast the next team fight? That blazing duet? Oh, we've seen this several times in the regular season. Four out of five. I gotta save my voice for MPLI. And it all just comes into this beautiful formula. This cocktail. Oh, oh my god. Oh, final slash. Final slash again on Oheb. Gonna force him to think twice. Sensui. Now Sensui gonna be the focus. They push him back. He can't even get near the lower yeah, right he's now. Down too much. But can that's still go through. He's too late even bro. with a heavy spin. Ogwin gonna jump in. They get the nether realm out. Flap TZ at the oh. front of the line. Final slash not gonna connect. Oh, no. But the way so Edward hitting. gonna jump Another. in. But oh my where's God, the fight, firepower fight. Oh, from Blacklist International? Oh, 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 the oh, blazing oh, duet's doing nothing. BMI? And they run Holy back. shit. How did Blacklist get out of that? They're happy with what they got. Boss! That's a luminous Boss! Boss! for them. Boss! Him a 6 k gold lead here just past 14 <laughs> minutes. Everyone waits with bated breath as our two M5 representatives Holy shit, it's are packed. putting on a clinic. It's packed. This is w how crowd. you play the game. W this crowd, is guys. the Philippine meta worked not once, not twice, but three world championships running, baby. Four years in a row and counting. The Filipinos have been on top of the world. Yeah. And this is Vote exactly number nine. Why. What is that? Look at this. I want to see the... You know what? Let's try the to read the messages of the fans. Put out your phones. Where are your messages? What are the messages? The home, this does give us a few moments to actually digest exactly what's going on. There's a lot going on here. Uh, and, you know, it... it we got the Blacklist again, fans, we got UF like fans in the building, Dexstar fans. I feel like this is a oh, way, are these, like, are these the players as girlfriends, kind of fell off a guys? Bit, right? I mean, What's your headset? Given the um, G735. The elections, oh, elections. Oh, shit, uh, maybe I haven't... Familiar, familiar should have said right anything. There, game seven. That's what we're hoping hey, for, Hey, Ray Ash! But, That's Ray yeah, Ash I, I, right there. You saw the Blazing Duet with the Heart Guard combination, right? It, I mean, it wasn't Can you speak John Cena's Chinese? No. Big Jiling. That's all I know. Makes you wonder if you somehow, if you're Blacklist or you buy another five maybe eight minutes mm -hmm. and that do you agree that most people do you agree most will competitive uh philippines is enough? more competitive right than indo now, they are dealing i think i agree just because of onik onik is not competitive onik number one alone that, at the top the and then pace, everyone else is competitive and in is philippines there's no the onik there's no that one team that is just dominating fucking god team you know like that's just up top there everybody's more it's more competitive because of that yeah because Indo, you know who's, who's going to be champions. The Before the season even started, even you know Onik was going to win. You know that there was only one slot. Oh. Hey, I know this guy. I know this guy. That's, that's water. Oh. Oh. That's John Paul. Oh. That's two out of the big hey, three. It's Yaowie and know. H2 well, and Midnight. Right yeah. Midnight Parating Libog, guys. Midnight Parating Libog. And Midnight. Midnight Parating Libog. <laughs>
We all know at some point Midnight was actually the coach for Next Play Evos back in MPL Philippines Season 9. Uh, but he did get to experience. I am retroactively jealous of Midnight. Yeah. Kind of wish I was Midnight sometimes. Midnight para ding libog. Looking back, I did get to drive him off to the boot camp and pick him up whenever we would need to go out, but. Really? The past is that. the past. Yeah, I didn't. Really? I did not know that. Yeah. At the time, Next Play Evos is. Uh, Alright, we're back. We're back in the game. Boot camp was very near my house. Anyways, back into the action here, folks. <laughs> Snap back to reality. Oops. We're about 14 minutes in to game number four. So there was my, that was my thing, right? I mean, Oheb has four items that he pretty much needs. He's even got a little defense here. But mm -hmm. like we saw previously as he works on this last item, there wasn't much damage at all being dealt to AP Brent. Yep, he's still on the way into that Malefic Roar. See if he can build it. And look at that. No Enchanted Talisman for the Valentina. Maybe that might be his next item. Nope, he's going to be going for a wand over there. Your nice Lord. Interesting choice. So he kind of used the necklace of Duranza, sort of like an enchanted talisman. All right, there let's see, go. let's see, guys. This might, this, might this might be the end. This might be the end. Oh! Their base, and look at the oh, burst They might be able here. to end here, actually. The burst is so much to deal with. Sensui feeling that as well. Turret going to go down. Top Two turrets and down. mid. Now making They're their way to the, the bottom. Siege. They want to fully expose Super this Marco base. Super Marco is still free hitting, right mate. Now. Again, final DPZ. Slap. DPZ. DPZ. Go oh, trouble. dude. The Super oh, Marco no. gets the, the Nether kill. Almost late. Now going to be working on the turret. It's Black over. Is down. Remember, no. AP Brand wants to push oh, it in. Not. Oh, they get oh, the oh, flicker oh. out. There's the blazing duo with the heart oh, guard. No. Keeping them at bay. Rekutiano. Rekutiano. Can they do it? Rekitiano, baby! That's my brother! That's moment, Super Marco! Brought to you by our official sponsor, G -G -G -G, WD Life wow. Insurance! And wow. the Hive knows exactly what's up! The Bees are just one game away from the championship! Rekitiano. Just like our expert wingman, they know it, they feel it! The one! Is what they're looking Damn. for. Damn. What do you think, Mirko of Oni ID playing MPL P? Do you think they're still going to dominate just like an MPL Indo? I think they're the still really, really good. Teasy bro. I what think, yeah, an maybe. A lot performance by Flap. <laughs> Again, it's a good thing. Saison Claude Old is fucking amazing. Yeah. Crazy. <laughs> he had it all the time. And half the time, Marco he wasn't is a chillist. Even using He's cold, bro. He's cold with it. You know, just like me, I'm cold with it. You know? Chop the roof and let the smoke clear. I'm cold. He's uh. Well, no, he's cold. He's cold with it. Let Mirko cast. I'm not even there, guys. How am I gonna cast? How tall are you, Mirko? I am one seventy six. Reverse sweep. Let's go. But it can't be a reverse sweep because they already have one game. Technically, it can be like comeback, but not reverse sweep. Frederick Requitiano. <laughs> Remember when Claude's ult cannot be cancelled? That was broken. Saison too cold with it? Jay's cast. Mirko, we close. Shut the fuck up, Jay's. Shut the fuck up, all right? Last time, RSG, SG were closer. They were one hit away from being champions. So now we just shut the fuck up. We just shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Okay? Shush, 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 shush. Who's the tallest caster you know? Tallest caster I know? It's Trex. I think Trex... Or is Naisu taller or is Trex taller? Okay, sit down. <laughs> Flapman Sup Super Marco. Super Marco. Ten I'm 10 centimeter meters taller than you, Mirko. What the hell? And I'm 17. That's how genetic works, man. And somewhere, somewhere in in uh, in uh, Sweden, there's gonna be a guy who's 14 years old, who's seven foot. <laughs> MTB is the tallest. MTB is tall, bro. What is your Chinese name? Teng Shangfa. I don't know if I pronounced it right, but yeah, that's my name. Gideon Q is tall. Yeah, Gideon is tall too. But Naisu is taller, I think. Mirko, I'm gonna push up for every fuck you say. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yo, thanks so much for the donation, Mr. Cairo. Cairo, base Mirko solos. Absolutely, sir. Base Mirko solos, everyone. W base Mirko, bro. W, w Cairo. Thank you, Cairo, for the 10K, man. That's uh, for the orange water. Thank you, sir. If PH1 and M5, PH Grand Slam, 
if ph win an m5 ph grand slam what grand slam are we talking about you know what, what is a grand slam guys grand slam is if you win uh, the trophies right all the trophies right msc and snapdragon already this year was uh onic so how could it be grand slam or does grand slam just mean three in that wait no what does grand slam mean guys does grand slam mean four Five consecutive champion equals the Grand Slam. All right, so it's not four. Some people are saying four. Some people are saying five. Five is Grand Slam or four is Grand Slam? What is a Grand Slam? I've never heard Grand Slam in my life. Is that a basketball term? Is that a basketball term, guys? Grand Slam? Four is Grand Slam, bro. Like basketball, four title win. Okay, so it's a basketball term. It's a tennis term. It's a sports term. I've never heard that in football. Grand Slam. All right. So four major championships is a Grand Slam. Okay, so in that case, yes. I think, yeah, PH Grand Slam. If they win, I think if they win MPLI and MPLPH, yeah, even if they win MPLI, Grand Slam. And then they win M5. If they win M5, then Grand Slammer. <laughs> what, what's after Grand Slam? What's five? Yo, Gee! Raven Shogun, welcome to the Alpha Squad. Thank you so much, man. Sue, my boy. Thank you. It is three, not four. Someone's saying four, someone's saying three, someone's saying five, bro. Golden Road is better, winning all major tournaments of the year. Golden Road? What term is that? What is a Golden Road? I swear to God, I have not heard these terms before, guys. Grand Slam in tennis is the achievement of winning all four major championships in one discipline in a calendar year. Okay, so it's a tennis term that is also used in basketball. Golden Road is from League. Ah, never heard Golden Road before, bro. Uh, I think here, if if Onyx, so Onyx already won MPLID, MSC, MPLID, Snapdragon. They can actually like if they win. Oh, they can't win MPLI. So they can win M five. If they win M five, then they'll be, they'll be. Um, is five quintuple? Is five quintuple, guys? Yeah, quintuple is five, right? Yeah. So they'll they'll be quintuple. Do you have a reaction video on Blackest vs Echo? No, unfortunately not, man. What does W mean? W is win. Win. Thoughts on Francis Ngannou versus Tyson Fury? Satu. I didn't watch it, but a lot of people said... Um, yo, Mirho, who's the captain of the biggest the dots? Nice suit, nice suit, biggest dots, for sure. You see the man? You see how big he is, bro? He is the definition of docs. Do you check on Trex if he's okay? Why? What's up with Trex, guys? Why am I getting this? Why, is, why are people telling me to check up on Trex? When AP Bren wins, you say, woo. Okay. Oh, the Super Marco meme. Yeah. Woo. Woo. How does he do it? Wait, we got to we gotta watch it. We got to see it. And we got to... The AP Bren Super Marco. Woo. Woo. Wait, Super Marco Woo. Super Marco Woo. Can't find it. Super Marco interview. Who clipped it? Who clipped the interview with the the woo? Who clipped the woo? Do you think Onyx ID is above all PH teams? I think right now, I think right now after MSC and Snapdragon, you can say that. But then M5 will be proving grounds, right? If they actually are consistent enough to take, if they take M5, then I think it's the fact for sure i think after sps is already a fact after msc is already a fact but then you know teams change new metas everybody adapts we'll see if they're still number one in the world with m5 what do you think about g2 versus blg i don't know i'm, I'm i don't know 
15K. Thank you so Dari much. Retro Grand. Retro Grand. Pesan. Grand Slam is someone who has won all major trophies possible. Ribos won Rianex. I'm So Grand Slam is if you win all major trophies. Okay. So C Games as well. Snipe Gaming clipped it. Okay, Snipe Gaming. Let's go. Where's the woo? Ah, here it is. Samsung Galaxy S23 FE. We got an ad, bro. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> bro. <laughs> the fucking... Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Bro, please get Super Marco to do the, another woo when they win. Woo. All right, guys. If AP Bren win, we go to the chat of English desk and we all just spam woo. Okay? We got to make this woo thing a thing. Oh, yo, 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 yo. H2 and uh, H2 and... Chapter <laughs> woo. that the smoke clear. We're getting interviewed. Ronnie J. Renny J, may ginagawa siyang dance usually. Ano nga bang tawag doon? Baka Renny J ito. Okay, okay. Habang kinakanta mo, habang kinakanta mo, oh, ako na lang. Seven. Okay, okay. Kasi ikaw rin mo, ikaw rin mo, dam sayo mo rin. Hindi ko, ko rin. Oh my God. What are you talking about? Okay, What are they saying, chat? Someone translate. Oh, Where are the subtitles? Okay, okay, okay. Sige, Where go. The, Three, two, two one. Man. Baka Renny J ito, baka Renny J ito, baka What is the song? What is the song? <laughs> Baka Rene Jato. Dapat kayo sa pinasayaw ako. Okay. Sige nga. Okay. Si si Rene J right now. Kung Is Rene J a song? Rene J has a song? Feeling ko kailangan niya na ilabas yung signature hero niya eh. Yung Chu. Tingin ikaw. Tingin mo. Oh, ikaw. Ako oh, tingin ko Matilda. Hero niya. Matilda and Cho. Kapag mali kayo, anong gagawin niyo? Kailangan mag-post kayo sa social media mamaya. Oh, anong gagawin mo? Uh, di ko alam eh. I'll listen to Baka Renegy. I will listen to Baka Renegy ito. Renegy is a singer. Sa lahat ng nanonood, Dude, kapag everything. nagkamali kayo, okay, kailangan yung sayawin. Yung Baka Renegy ito. Oh, sige, Baka ganun lang. Oh, yun, yun ha. Oh, okay. Nag-promise sila. Nag-promise sila. Ito, yung blacklist. They're down right now. Match point. Ano ba kailangan gawin? What are they laughing? Hey, guy, I'm the one that's not Rene J. What did they say? What did he say? Why is he laughing? What did he say? What did he say, chat? Did someone? Rene J. Quiet, but Rene J. What do you expect? Ah. They must vocal, ba? They must nang gigigil yun pag ano? Lamang yung alaban. Mayre, mayre verse sweep yun. Cha, feel ko kailangan kailangan yaring ayos. Kailangan na? Kailangan niya rin kasi mag-wow siguro sa stage eh. Oh, kailangan niya mag-wow. Mamaya mag-wow kayo, sabi niya, pag mali kayo ha. Choy Matilda. Put trust in Rene J. Ah, Rene J. I see. Uh, message ko, Rene J. Ano, super proud daw sa iyo na nakarating ka ng finals. Oh, and, na. Um, yun, good luck. And sana makuha niya itong champion. Kaya mo to. <laughs> yun, uh, good luck sa iyo, Rene J. Alam kong matagal mo nang ginagrind to simula NXP. So, nakaka-proud na... Nasa finals ka na rin and may chance ka pa rin, may, may chance ka pa mag world champion. Yeah. Nakakatuwa nga, no? Where are the, eh, where are the subtitles? Ba, subtitles. Uh, oh, oh. Babalik ka? Ooh. Anong Pero, team? Abangan niyo daw sang bansa daw. <laughs> Aba, <laughs> ah! What did he say? What did he say, guys? Sa Pilipinas? Sa Pilipinas? What did he say? What did he say? Um, secret, secret. Secret! Bawal pa sabihin. Okay, what did I should say? The crowd went wild. So ngayon, ready na sila. Sabay-sabay natin iba to sa ating mga casters. Casters? Pasok. What did Yowie say? What did Yowie say? Not to take the attention away H2 from this import? very critical moment, but oh, H2 import. H2O, as instigated by Yowie, may have dropped oh, the bomb Oh, Yowie's in those? Is that there real? Was, uh, some H2 there. plays outside of PH. Maybe okay. What did he say? What ah. He said? Secret? Think about it. Draw the lines, look back oh, at their wow. affiliations and very close relations. You'll know what we're talking about. Welcome back to the desk at your service. My name is Leo here with Naisu and Renmar Santa Cruz. It's us, We Bear Bros. Smack dab right in the middle of this best of seven. Currently, that's, that's cool. the score is three to one with AP Brennan match point right. pushing Black oh, Peter's the world. Hero to stats. the limit. Let's talk about some stats real quick about roamers all around Jeez, the world. Jeez, Ogwen 100% of the Philippines and one Indonesian man. I'm a big fan of Keyboy, by the way. Yeah. Keyboy! We, uh, I think a lot of us are fans of Keyboy. Spam into the chat, uh, guys. But if you're, if Keyboy! If you're up, 
the there's MSC a very line. distinct play style from these roamers. Uh, and see it, it in his eyes. That right there. That ain't Boloisky. Yeah. And that's Ogwin green. Is the roamer for the season, and no. he's flexing it. There were some doubts on uh, his inclusion <laughs> into that list, but I believe ever since their upper bracket finals match against uh, Blacklist International, and even here now, he's really showed off why he's the all-star roamer. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't know his Matilda was 100%. I went, I assume it was a pretty high win rate, but no, at a hundred percent. Excuse me. Wow. Dear Lord. Jovic, Jovic, Jovic. I do miss me some Boloiski again. Jovic and a time Aik, where he the Rafaela game Aik after game after game Yola, And then he does have the pocket ruby. And of course, yeah, the boy on his Kaja. And, and Neug, he didn't break out heroes in season 12. Ogwen. Do you think? That he's actually going to do it? Do you who's think actually boy? Who's Jay, spicy boy? Uh, this I is Key Boy. You know, translate some things here for our international viewers. That's you, right. Well, they probably heard the, the hero correct name. translation is more of like the or, Mana, uh, what was his Mana name? Spicy Boy, Mana Miracle, Miracle Boy. This is Key Boy. It's I, like, where I is would, not what? If, if it works, not who? Lineup, where I'd is? I'd like to see him on the show. Where is Spicy Boy? Where is the Miracle Boy? This is Key Boy. So far, it's who. The woman is asking what Renegade is. Yo! One euro. No way. I don't think RQH is. I don't think so. On the show. On the show in a regular I don't think it's RQ. Alter Ego, I think, need a new jungler as well. So maybe Alter Ego. They're not playing for I don't remember the line at all. So miss your keyboard from RC man, yeah, bro. And these days the There's show so many is edits a about like of, of that. Uh, it's so cool. Acquired taste. Your yeah. draft has to favor the show. Yo, thank you so much for the donation. At this point, I wouldn't even compare. Uh, PH versus the world. Yo, 0.82 GBP Drago. Shout out to the recess squad and my boys, Leon, Dan, Bara, Yeah, we do. So far, again, in this series, it's. Oh, 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 PH vs. the World, Hero Stats, Few, Yue, Rosa, and Warlord! Nah, 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 we're sans, sir. We're sans, sir. We're sans. Nah, 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 nah. Where's my boy? Where's my boy, Sans? Where's the best player of all time, Moren? I'm joking. Yeah, interesting that they haven't yet because it's been just been a lot of... Where's my boy, Sans, though? Where's my boy, Sans? I mean... We my went boy from, Sands. I would say, in the regular season of a lot of flexibility and variation in the mid lane to like... God damn, 100% of Arya is, you know, is, is a crazy stat though. By the time we got the and then into playoffs, you know, so... But I just think that's where things fell into place, especially after that whole patch came through. Yep, to be fair, as season 12 Gila. started, I think the general consensus, the zeitgeist of the Sans MLB Sports <laughs> community was... Rose 100%. This is pretty tight. Alter Ego needs Yaoi in H2. Dude. And now they need a. I, th I believe they need a the mid laner and healthy. a gold like laner. Oh, sorry, mid laner and a jungler. There's a good amount of give in all roles in all positions. And H2 to Aura? Aura? No way. I don't think they H2 to Aura. I think they want to trust in uh, their van. The in van. But Yaoi role, to Aura, I think I can, I can see that for sure. Because given now, look, even your signature Akai. Yeah, might not even cut it anymore. Maybe Among AP the three, H2, Yaoi, and Renege, H2 is the most skilled player when they are still teammates. Pick a page out of RSG's book. Mirko, if you join Bring BTR as a talent Aldous. or something else, you should use your IGN as Super Crazy. Mirko or Baba Mirko. I was not expecting that. Yeah, that would be funny. <laughs> Tell Mirko to listen to Bakar and Ajayto. I will listen to Bakar and Ajayto. Told you guys, I get you. What if, you know, he increases stacks? He hurts. He scales surprisingly fast, folks. But we're talking about match point. <laughs> Isn't that... Is that too much risk? Am I dreaming right now? What, is... <laughs> what are we talking about? Is this like... Guys, okay, is okay. This... think about it. These two, what they've d done in the playoffs, they've made it this far because of Here, the Here, I'll, I'll be on the counter desk with, with Reptar. With drafting. Yes, okay. Reptar. You're it's right. It's an insane theory. Yes, I probably sound crazy to my majority you're, of you're our viewers watching sir. right now, but I don't care because I believe in it. I they've believe in you too, before. Reptar. I, I love don't you, know man. if I can jump on board the Aldous no, yeah, train. Exactly, no. Don't <laughs> ignore me, guys. Right, I'm on the desk too. Nice, what the up, fuck? Be here you gotta talk to me, man. What the fuck? I told guys. you so. Until then. What the fuck, guys? Until then. What do you think? Hey, you yeah, have a hairbrain prophet hey. that says that the end is nigh. I'm gonna be a meme. <laughs> I'm that doomsayer who is like, oh, the world is ending and everyone's just the like, The sky is fine. falling. The sky is falling. Thanks Pick for, Aldous. Thanks for calling me Chicken Little just now. Why am I not part of Bear Bros? Throwback, hey. Uh, uh, wow, that revealed my age. But yeah, yeah it's, a, it's, Take a, your it's a classic. Uh, this will be animation. funny if I actually have a green screen so I can oh, actually like be in the middle of them. Okay, back okay, when it was just called animation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, okay, I'm sort of messing around here. But uh, the point I'm trying to make, of course, is... Why is Edith the prior pick? See if we can flex something. You have like the biggest CC combo, the long 
longest duration of CC combo. Onward, Earth Shatter is the longest chain of of CC that that is like yeah, that is possible if you get both. And it's such a very instant engage, and you also have like a very easy escape with Primal Wrath. You got good damage. You got good engage. You got good pick. You have very long CC. It's it's W, and that's why it just got banned again by AP Fred. Boom. Can take us Fredrin, to Baksha, Edith. Seven because Boom, AP bang, on match point, folks. Here Nolan, we go. They're also Joy, the play, by out. the way. Final Yo, 100 pesos. Joy, Ellie. Ellie, you are a double. Ellie, you are a double. Epic comeback moves. Epic appeals to all of us. That would be cool if they actually come back. Malam bang Mirko, malam Eka. Airborne is such a disgusting CC. If Sans makes a good play in M5, you can say Grabe Sans instead of Gila. Grabe Sans! Have we seen Edward actually play? That would be funny, right? Because we're in the Philippines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what, did, what did he switch Grabe. up to? Because the Trizla is Grabe crazy, that, guys? I don't know. Or maybe they what need is to crazy in uh, Because the Feramis is picked up Tagalog. first from AP Bren. So they're there. You're right. It's, it's, it's Trizla every time, right? Oh, no. He's been Riz yeah. this whole time. Yeah. One Feramis. One yeah. They pick it up right, now. Yeah. They're it's taking it away. Okay. See that Baliu Sans, Baliu. Okay, no, Baliu just... Kasans. Grabe okay, is crazy. Akai, oh, okay. So just use Grabe. <laughs> That's already settled. Grabe but is yeah, acceptable. Okay. All right. So they don't Akai go crazy, and so Valen. Oh, oh. Those Believe are good picks, bro. Get with what those are good picks from BLCK. All season long, and I'm not gonna knock those picks. It's worked out for a long time for them. Let's see if they could pull that through. And for AP Bren, what else is left on the table? Notice See, me from. To, Notice me. You look like Super Marco. I do not look like Super Marco. Do Do I look like Super Marco, guys? I don't look like Super Marco. Roman do I look like? Unless I'm also just not going to look like Super Marco. This might be I don't think I look like Super Marco. Arlott. However, that's usually picked up against assassins. So good chance it is XP lane, and it'll make Blacklist think, Hey, are we still go really going to pick up the Terizla? Or are we gonna do something? You look like CW. Yes, hundred percent. You look like Flap. You know, maybe if they feel like it. This early on. You look like Super Miracle. As a preemptive answer, maybe Brand might ban it out. Want something more aggressive? You played so many games. Bruno. So they'll Martis go for their first Bruno. So they're gonna try and finish. Mm. Super Marco, now they banned the Eri. Yo, they banned the Iksha. Iksha first. Okay, they don't have any dive. Cool. Closing the gap here. You look like MTB. You look like Kyrie. You look like CW. You look like Renegade. I look like everyone. Yeah. Fuck you guys. <laughs> you look Man, like Coach Airpom. They understand. I think the numbers don't matter to them anymore. <laughs> right now, what we're reading, what we're seeing is they're in a state of flow. Yeah. Mirko they understand that this is the kit we need. This is how we've been playing so Mirko far. And it's not We all don't catch up to the pace. You look like Moreno. We're taking home the championship. Okay, so they're pinching the Super Marco picks and AP Brand. Oh, Bali is an offensive Taking word, okay. Taking out the Diggy while they 100 have 100% win rate for Flap T3. Something. Ogwen's pick here might be more Brody and Iksha banned tar. out. But, well, sorry, excuse me? The Tar. The Tar. The tar? And the Mino. Oh. Oh, but the giving tar. it to the Valentina though is very risky. Yeah, Especially it is very risky to leave it to Valentina. What do you, what do you give but it is Ogwen's signature the pick. Realm or the Fury. Hmm. That's true. There's some level of uh, Diggy Ban. What are they going for with the Diggy Ban? What are they going for, Chad? They're going for something crazy with the Diggy Ban. You can do to deal with the Valentina is to just huh. overload her in choices. Yep. Your, your, your engagement and the way you approach fights change depending on what ult you steal. Novaria Ban oh, there. Oh, finally. Novaria shows wow. up as a ban. <laughs> Novaria Rome respected for Renegade. <laughs> She's not going to be picked today, man. At least for now. Here you can see Coach Dexar hovering over the Hitman's shoulder. And Coach MTB seems to be spewing off a bit of instructions. What is the play here? Is this a time? True Ube. The final Ube. That's what we're... Uh, they go oh, for he's got it. Oh. Oh, oh, here no. we go. Oh, oh. Agent Zero Bennett. Papa Dub Bennett. We got it. When you go back we got to it, Agent Chad. Zero's roots. Papa Dub yep. Bennett. T tough for the Clint. Let's tough go. for the Beatrix. Let's go. So they're going to really Pop have up. to make... Benedetta popping like up. Blacklist approaches. Now they're going for fast. They're going for speed. They're going for quick scaling. Alapi Bren, <coughs> how are they going to round this out? Are you still just going to go Irithel here? Classic Iri Bruno. What is Dude, your roamer? What do they go for now? Go for setup. Pick off. Maybe. APBR. APBR. What if you go what Kaja? Is... What if you go Frank? What what do APBR oh, but play? But ultimates not to Valentina. It's a tough, tough choice. Yeah. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Go for it's a it's a trade. It's an obvious trade. Oh, down it has to the be Irithel or Beatrix. It's Irithel. 
Irithel. It's Ruby. Ru oh, the this is, a is watching. Ruby. And saying, hey, I know that hero. Interesting. Uh, there's so Ruby. much CC available to AP Bren. Bro. Uh, and I guess that's exactly why they took the Diggy out. Same situation as game four, man. Yeah. Four and one. It's just the Irithel that really is just dishing out damage. Everyone else puts you in place. Okay. What do Blacklist what play, guys? What do Blacklist pick? pick? <coughs> but no, I'm leaning towards... Wait, wait, that sounds Koopa. weird. Purple Koopa? Oh, oh, there it is. It's back. It is back, folks. Wait, so the Akai is the Rome? Yep. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. yeah. P you, that and was the K. Swing. Yeah, that was the swing. I was and about Koopa. It. So, this, ladies and gentlemen, is actually not a signature of Renegade, but a signature of his former compatriot, Yaoi. This is a signature Akai Rome. Speaking of Yaoi, him and H2, Let's go. Marakino, a dance All right, guys, media. it's they time to vote. In honor of their it's time to vote. Good friend and brother, because they, they didn't pick the show. Game the number five. Yeah. Support you AP Bren or AP Blacklist Bren, crowd control. draft. Very, very close. Objective close. Push a little bit stronger for Blacklist. Let me know, guys. Who do you guys think? Bruno. Overall wins. damage. This is a very <laughs> on par draft. I think the only edge right now from AP Baron is the burst that they have. The Benedetta might struggle here, but the thing is, this Popolin Koopa is set up for success. It's not gonna be the Bruno, it's the Popolin Koopa they've set up for success. They're up against the Benedetta in that lane. It's gonna be good for Sansui. There's a magic word that Blacks International have to consider, and AP Bren are starting to wonder, how do we address this? And that's range. Let's go, boys, land it on to get this done. Kyle versus Sensui like again. Not gonna let it happen, not is it gonna so be, quick. Is it gonna be over? Is it over, guys? Do you guys think it's over? For the type over or type no in the chat right it's now? Do you think AP it's gonna be 4-1? Look at this. Someone's in there. There's a big fat panda. playing into this side of the jungle. Just gonna get the information that they need and work around with that. It's over? Oh, Renegade. Well, over, uh, damn, we got some Blacklist overs in the chat. Over. They know that they can control it's the go Jover. speed here of Kyle TZ. If they just send their Akai, they wouldn't have to worry. Uh oh. Kyle gets his buff without a problem. Uh oh. I wonder if oh. They're gonna punish him. Uh oh. This is troublesome. Oof. Already getting that flicker out. It's good flicker. that he had that, but uh, again, you know, this is crucial for the Akai Blacklist. Rome level one to three. Akai you're just vlogging, bro. You're a vlogging Romer. You're just, brand, especially just around that nether realm. holding your camera, walking around. There's not much you can do. All but level four, that's you what you're looking for. for. You're no longer for vlogging at level four. And tenacity actually for the Bruno. So Lima Yo, Bruno delapan. Thank you so much for the June Palmero. Pesan. June Palmer. It's Tim Palmero. Thank you so much. Team Secret Wave Show is heading for Chico Istere. Ah, that, that's Russian cool. Damage. H2O it's going to Team yep. Secret. That's Triple cool. Triple flicker on AP Bren. I think that's how they're going to address the whole range situation. Renegade oh. in trouble. Renegade, they oh. know he doesn't have a flicker Whoa, here. First blood. First blood. Good damage. Through the hands oh. of Kyle TZ. Haji. There's the answer, Haji. though. Haji couldn't get the cleanup Even he was bite looking him, for. Bite him, Koopa. Bite him, Koopa. Bite him. joins right. a little bit late. So first blood in the hands of AP Brent. Great space here for Blacks International, given that they sent Kyle well, DZ home. they can burst home. this actually really and fast. Sensui looking Yo, look at Sensui's clear, dude. Look at that jungle. Uh, dude, this is so fast. Uh, not a word look at him. Look at Sensui. Super it fast. No, they can't do it. They, it's, it's Sensui for Should sure. Should be able to. They're going to yep. try to hold it down. Sensui will secure it. Now AP Bren just going to back off here. So Black fast. Black is happy with that. Yeah. Good read of the situation by... Blacklist International, seeing the Kalti's, he got three hits from that turret. Of course, the Terrify from Haji's Valentina coming in clutch. Daily first one time that. draw. So it'll be a reset. Fifty percent off. Brand. Abyssal Same Wings a, limited time return. Chat. By getting the second turtle or maybe a gank. Something to talk about is the bottom what lane. What is the matchup. standing? Gold lane. The standing is three to one Let's right now, chat. Over there. I oh, one v one. Clear that maybe. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait. Edward. Eye for an eye. Oh. Eye for an eye. Right I at see the you. final slash. Yep, <laughs> that's what Edward says. Okay. The Hefe of the Efe. Eye for an eye. Efe. Hefe for the Efe. Great. That works. <laughs> cool. But I like it. Here we go. Live the wonder Rip fight. Fire. You don't. Still oh, gonna oh, be going oh, wow. here. They find the lockdown with a heavy spin. Trying to turn it around. They can't do it. Might be Blacklist too, too Black International Black finds what they need to in the early part of this game. And now they're gonna push Super Marco back from Dude, the turret as well. At Bruno Marco and Popo. Look at how fast this turret falls. And look at this three-minute push. Is it happening? Wow. That's what Blacklist wants to do. 
and they are able to maximize it. Oheb actually didn't rush it. He was waiting. Look at Oheb. He's trying to deny this gold, uh, go, gold minion. Get something out of it. The Sakai pick up surprise by Blacklist International, working out very Almost well. Almost a for thousand them. gold it's between the gold leaders already. And Oheb already at this point, they're okay. Yeah. Has lost already built up by the Bruno. One thousand is the gold lead. I'm not hundred percent sure, but I feel like for Dude, this, this gold lead for series, look at the gold lead, the and gold lead, and the uh, jungle gold lead. Two thousand gold right now for Blacklist International. A ton of that also just helping them scale up really well. Again, you mentioned this, Renmar, in the draft. They want to go fast. They want to build up and scale fast, and Oheb is on course for that. How better do it than to shrink the map and make that gap between your gold lane mate all the more larger? Yeah, they're playing around the mortal coil of the Faramis as well. Every time they see that he can no longer avoid being crowd controlled, Blacklist just go all in. It's going to be a crucial one once again. The fight for this turn. Oh, Renegade. There goes oh, Renegade. Oh, goes in with huge down. Electo final blow. Beautiful Flap final Teasy blow. Flap TZ, quite low. Good Sensui secure. secures the second Man, Black turtle is snowball, here. Guys. And Blacklist is on to a great start. Amazing. A single heavy spin. Able Haji? to neutralize Ooh. two or three heroes from AP Brand single-handedly. Wow. What a surprise pickup by Blacklist. And it's working out in spades. And it's working out everywhere. As Renegade doing what a the petrify, dance man. of his own Three man petrify. Renegade. I didn't need to translate it. Baka Renegade. And you see right now, just that Irithel is getting decimated in lane because of how well Blacklist were able to supplement Oheb. Super Marco can't do much. At some point, I think Avery Bren will have to understand the fact that they will lose. A oh! oh a huge! I'm offended in the what? final slash! What a combination! A wombo combo! Super Marco gets a double! Double kill out of it. Huge. AP Bren. Wow. Clap back. Ogwen, right wow. then and there. Heavy spin wow. versus I'm offended. What is a true Ogwen. game changer? Damn. World, those are our rovers right, for Ogwen. M5. And they've been putting on a show so far. And I feel like that was the most respectful recall spam ever. That's acknowledgement of game. Game recognized game by Renegade and Ogwen. Like Ricochet and Will Ospreay from NJPW. You know it, man. Looking at this bottom lane. I want to see the gold now. So Rocco just got a double well, kill. Does that equal Blaster out the, the, the gold for Ohev and Marco? Here. Are they changing gears? Because they know now that, hey, if Ogwen makes a call, they can collapse. It's going to be a slightly different uh, changing of gears. And by that, I mean they're just going to switch up lanes. Uh, try to make the most out of the map uh, spray, map space creation Hello, uh, from the Benedetta. But yes, they're really going to have to watch their positioning as well. They love clumping up together. They got to be careful with that. What a set. So yeah, far, that was a very, uh, very all turtles crazy set. The Blacks International. AP Bren yet to get one. Last one spawning up in the upper quarter. Five seconds from now. And I'm liking the control that AP Bren are... Uh, putting here because they can force the issue they can force these big ticket ults right yeah, but blast international they're spreading out too far so not happening just yet blacklist looking to keep this 2k gold lead as it stands though watch with me international are winning the map oh, oh, flap, flap, flap. again flap tz flap, goes in flap. with flicker the final oh, they, get to they lose their jungler never mind when they come back what is Red 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 runs out of here and oh, trying to keep man. them at bay oh, when, oh, when, 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 there's when, the follow when, the when, Will fall and now it's Haji Gwen. in trouble all Dude, left alone. So good. What a statement from oh AP Brett. Oh it's the Gwen. Filipino cannon and master Oakwin yet again. It looked like Blacklist countered that beautifully with Edward's fuck? eye for an eye, petrified. But AP Brett what? said, No, no, this, is this turtle is mine. Kyle Teasy here scores Holy it shit. with Renege hoping oh maybe my find God. that small frame. <sighs> That Dude, small this, window how did they to win? steal, and with that, Since Blacklist and loses the lead. 1,000 gold. Just about 400 gold. gold ahead. Ladies and gentlemen, Each. few oh now rank second God. in the MPL all-time assists. Dude, the skill, the skill dips in the last two, two team fights, man. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. There's the lockdown with heavy spin. They'll find Flap Teasy. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Renegade is still confident. And Blacklist showing AP Bren, you can pick, we can pick too. AP Brand needs to gather their bearings right now. Super Marco able to push that bottom lane. Side lanes gonna come back for both teams. How well they can manage it because right now AP Brand, they've just been able to catch Blacklist off surprise with those two pickoffs that they were able to do. Whoa, 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 Kyle Teasy. He got it. Stolen. Got it. Grant that purple. Bang. Guilty. Top wow. lane though, left to his own devices, Oheb. 
He's farming up pretty well. Again, we talked about how Sinsui is the pivot point. He will be the fulcrum of Blacklist's comeback here in the series. But so far, when can we expect Oweb to make a difference? Well, he has the items right now. Oh, wait, they're still just up to a Berserker's Fury. Uh, he can make a difference just by staying alive, staying in the back. It's close uh -oh. enough. It's not that the uh, Edward is big, actually two uh, levels ahead of Flap, dude. Difference between him and the Aerithel is just that, yeah, AP Friend have just oh, been able to stayed. surprise Blacklist and they've been playing off their game. The positioning, though, of Oheb, I must say, uh, he needs to count skills a bit better. Oh, uh oh, Gwen. Oh, 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 Gwen. Look at this looking for his own setup. Oh my here. god, oh my god. No way, check? no way, no they way. Didn't check they this. didn't check, they didn't this check. This could be very troublesome. Rena J, gonna be able to find him out. There's the I'm offended. Can he get oh, away from no, this? No. Heavy spin oh. out, gets dragged back. Oh. No flicker, no heavy spin, bro. To stay alive and all this, 10 seconds away for the Lord. Two, two minutes until Rena J can actually get in with a heavy spin flicker play. That'll make this Lord all the more difficult for Blacklist to secure, which explains why AP Baron just standing around here. They're controlling the mid lane and eventually, oh, there's the pull. Super Marco, uh, Super Marco, third item, Great Dragon Spear. This is AP Brand saying, we'll hit our power spike now and we will end this quicker. Now, rather oh, than oh, they're gonna have to battle this out. Ogwen oh, goes in. Four nice Marco, look at Marco. Look at this who's guy. Who's gonna get another realm gonna be worked oh, on? Wait, he's Super dead. He's dead. Oh, he was free hitting for a while. He's dead. 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 With the heavy spin, that turret held on Pe with Sensui one HP, old Marco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but now the old Lord Q. makes its way up old top. One. Oh, look at that, Agent Zero working on that dead lane down bottom, pushing it deep. AP Bren are cordoned off, wow, they are wow, locked wow. inside their own base, they have to defend. How do they Edward lose doing? that fight? Oh, what the oh, fuck? Oh, oh, oh. Agent Zero. Edward. Pop it up. Does it. Pop it up. Gets the turret. Pop it up. Make the escape oh, here. No. Final Slash gonna keep him there from getting away. Oh, Edward will dead. go down. But he got the base turret. Expensive, worth. but worth it. Worth it. Because of the lane equi equilibrium, AP Brand can't actually push out aggressively with a 5 versus 4 advantage. So definitely worth it. A great play there by Agent Zero. Bro, Mirror Curse, Mark. Bottom lane. That was a fast Mirror Curse. They're taken care bro. of. AP Brand needs to clean up a bit. Yeah, yeah. They need to Marco turn the doesn't map have Purify, so he can't really make those moves. He needs a bit of nature to be able to do that. Oh, Does he have a nature? I don't think he has it them. They're looking at about a 3k, 4k gold lead. Let's check out that Lord turn once more. Look at this, look what at this. There. Look at Marco's Benji positioning, right? Koopa. He's really, really good. Oh, he dodges away from the Petri. That's when I was like, Marco, look at Marco. And then he went a bit too far Ogre. bottom. He should have went up here. But yeah, that was, Black was made a solid line and there, and that's how they won. Wow, man. Also, what a turn. Like over eagerness from the Kadam machine, bro. Oh, the communication synchronization Instant of Black International compromised Fuse decision making. He held on to the flick. So he used another realm first before flickering in. Didn't even use the flicker in the holy Popo game. Anyways. So it was that yep. space difference. He couldn't have saved his teammates. Crowd goes wild. AP Brand, <laughs> Super Marco already has that win of nature. One of those moments. So That's now he has win of nature. Folks. All right, this is why he has win of nature, guys. Witness it, right? <laughs> yeah. uh, but. What we are seeing is basically the fact that Black Wizard National oh, fighting conceal. for their lives uh -oh. here. Oh, oh. Spotted Big out by the trap. Conceal play stopped, stopped by a, a trap. Little bit of Koopa's doo -doo. That's how I'd like to think the trap is sometimes. <laughs> but Isn't it a frost trap? <laughs> I mean, that's what it feels like. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's what it feels like. You know. If you're on the opposing side of a Popolin Koopa, and that's why this lineup is so good. That's why. Say what you will about Popolin Koopa in the jungle, but as long as his heroes in the metagame, yeah. Vision suddenly becomes a surplus. You, you suddenly just control parts of the map you couldn't have prior. Yeah. Trap placement, very important. That allows a little bit more breathing room for Blacklist International in terms of dealing with all the surprise engagements that Flap TZ and Ogwen are giving. 
Again, the pressure being put onto the map by Edward is just too much right now for AP Red. The Equilibrium isn't on their side. Haji has another round. They're Marco rushing is it. Bought through. Gonna go for Red J. Gonna dive in. Keep the Kyle Tizi at bay. Heavy spin, spin gonna heavy come spin. through. Still gonna be working on the spin, Lord. Dude. Blacklist will secure it. Open. Now Hogan gonna jump in. Edward joins the fight. Oh, oh, oh. Can they help him out? Another round gonna be used. Super Marco will jump in. He'll get Marco. stunned. Wind of Nature. Can they Marco. get you down? Wind of Nature. Oh, 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 is gone. Edward on the chase. Does he oh catch up? Oh my god! Oh, the final blow along fight. with it, he'll get it! But members are Edward. down for Blacklist International! Papa they got Dom. the Lord! They got Super Marco! And Agent wow. Zero got away with it! Big trade here, AP Bread, two for one. Oh, wait, but wait, they pop it up. Wait, wait, one. wait. And now, Edward, still oh, going! Oh no, not like this. Edward, bang! Pop it up, decimated. No. But now, Lord here in the mid, Rene J and Sensui. There's not much they can do with this. They bought some more time. Gentlemen, I have a theory. Could the Akai Rome switch up be the reason why Coach Master of the Basics was smiling right before the game began? Was Could it the been. fact that the heavy spin is now in a roll that previously never had it? And that just nullifies a lot of what AP Bren wants to do. Could it have could have been with a priority on the Valentina. It does seem like it. And it's working. Very well right now for Blacklist. Edward but told to this day carrying Blacklist. Now nah, everybody's Blacklist doing well, man. Still Sensui in also control. very, very Item good. check right now, fully built. Amy Brenner that with the kill lead, but mistaken. Blacklist with the gold yes, lead, man. While the Bruno is just waiting for one more item there, waiting in the wings. Melfic Roar, Marco. Melfic Roar was the last one. What a fight, yeah. This is a... It's crazy. Super Marco this is fun. needs to be a little bit more safer with his engagements. He's getting kills, but he shouldn't be going down. I can't blame Super Marco for the record he's had and, of course, his behavior in the last team fights. Yeah. Blacks International are just so good at dispersing and spreading out damage and threats. Because yet they have two Bro. marksmen. One corner isn't safe, and it's a Adrian just got a team fight all the way, man, to win. They, they, they just got a team fight. They literally yeah, yeah. just come in at That's all it. angles. Like, I'm afraid that they can't behind control me right neutral now. objectives with well, Renegade I mean, on this Akai. He's making his way. Look at him, his position. The mortal coil isn't enough, I think. And the flicker reposition <laughs> for Renegade just with Akai here. just we know that, but gives him so is many issues like in the team fight. Right? Uh, in the neutral objective contest. A signature pick either get like a big this, set from like Blackers can win to the team fight as well though. The so it's like teams. harder for AP Red because the two MMs make it, it really hard to control neutral objective the with Akai. Side, they burst it so fast, bro. You not only have bro. an extra body, but also the split push potential is there if they decide to do a last ditch effort, if they need it. But right now, that's the main concern for AP Brand is where it all comes down to Marco. I think, man, from. Marco needs to yeah. just Marco needs to free hit. But how does he free hit against this team? Edward's always hunting Maybe for him. Maybe yeah. Blacks International is holding on to that tier one in mid, and that's a main artery. That's one of the reasons why AP Brand can't rotate or push up as hard. Yeah. And that's what's making these major objectives all the more difficult for them to lean into, to commit. Yeah. Excuse me, I actually meant to say uh, in the bottom lane, because it looked like they were shadowing Super Marco with a push uh, down bottom. Few versus Edward uh, up just top. Just to mirror the fact that the pressure uh, being Flat applied by mobile Edward at all, man. He can't actually just just, like, deal with the far right lanes. It's he forcing to go for the them fight. to react. This is the most reactive team fighting experience. Better, dude. Edward's like giving so many problems. Yo, series. guys, check out Meat Spin. Edward Haji. Oh, 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 oh you're gonna be in trouble. Eight zero gets the kill. AP Brendo here one. on the answer. They're one gonna go ahead one. and work down on Haji. Lord. He's down as well, no, but the Lord, Lord secured wow. for Blacklist International. Value. Wait, unless AP Brendo fight this. Four v five. Four v five. They know. They're chasing. They're chasing. They know that he was back. Can they force it? AP Brendo. They're lo going. Lo oh. They're looking for the long haul here. Oh yeah, my they God! Have a minion, Wait, they're actually they've forcing actually this shit, dude. Minion. They can actually get two here. Thank you, Marabu shit, for the member for six months, man. Oh, no, they're not going to they're not going to risk it. No, they're not. Okay. More breathing room is just what they wanted. It's five. Haji will be back in time for a siege. See, Halbert was the last item built up by the Bruno. Wow. Something tells me AP Brand was looking for more in that trade. Yeah. I think one of the reasons why they also stopped was because of that trap the Flap Easy stepped on. Oh, Ren J. Ren J gonna get trapped Ren J here. Still has the immortality though. So he'll be fine. 
Can Black Lizard National actually do anything lose, with this uh, base lore? They yeah, secured sure, bottom themselves down. at the almost 18 minute mark. I said on the not. bottom and hit They fucking rush at it. Edward gonna All use right. a, like wow. the final Good blow clear. out of there. Holy shit. But they still, got they're gonna be clear. putting the pressure here now on the top and bottom. Unexpected Black crazy clear. CJ oh, Edward again, Edward. dude. Edward. Edward Tauti gonna be popped. He will go down here. Not Where able to get the turret. Edward now they could be six. caught out. Rene J gonna get pulled. Has to heavy it's so spin. Uncharacteristic. So what still, the fuck? AP Bread Edward. holds on to the two base turrets. Damn. Again, because of their management, even though they're getting kills on Edward, there's someone else pushing on the opposite side, meaning that the minions are pushed towards the side of AP Bren, and they can't make the most out of a 5v4 advantage. The moment Blacklist slips on managing the offside, then that's when AP Bren can pounce and oh, find man. a way. But they're no pouncing Edward. right no now. One's, it looks no like one's there to really threaten the, the Aerithel, no, man. No. So then Renegade did. already used all for yeah, sure tier two. I don't know if they can crack the base I think if they die, maybe. Five Fizzy can just old flicker. That one K gold lead, tier two down. But no, right, they, they, they're not risking it. They want to just get tier two. Okay. Minute, all the more a 50-50. Black International needs to control the long lane here. Talking about bottom. Boots Back sold already. Wind Talkers built for both go uh, and, uh, gold laners. Immortality for Kyle. Like they want to keep the flow of it at around that part. Few already has Whoa. a holy crystal. Crystal for few. Yeah, if he's he damaged, pure he's damage. He's gonna hurt even more so now. He actually prioritized the divine glaive earlier first. Uh oh, the oh, traps, the traps, traps again. Ren is spotted. For those. Ogwin. Damn, AP Bren are slowly but surely taking control back of the game, man. This is the disciplined approach that we've seen AP Bren do before. The Goldie's gone. Goldie so doesn't matter with anymore, the guys. Even Black Desert National was holding on to for a while. You can see that they're still Even if you're Edward, you can't escape the curse of Mirko. Wins in these yeah. fights against By the way, shout out to you guys. 2,000 viewers right now. Click that like button, guys. Let's get it up to 1,000 likes, my boys. Mirko, let's go. And if you guys are new on the channel, click that subscribe button. We have a lot more content out later. We also have update failed. Wait. We also have M5 vlogs later. So now, to answer the question, Blacklist can definitely just split push. Blacklist can definitely overload AP Bren's decision making. But AP Bren can decide the turn. If AP Bren finds that perfect turn, which they have Good yet lane to cut do, by here. the way, folks, in this 20 minute game, okay. then it could be. That's the Lord, started up by Singsui, looking for the pull. River control by both. AP Bren now, more bodies on the scene. Minions come in again. They got a flap needs to cut again, or someone needs to cut top bot, pit. or Edward might be able to just take it. Forward. Renegade is the one getting vision for Blacklist International. They have to pull the trigger mm. on Look at Edward. Because now oh, they're just rushing it. They just want a 50-50. They got to come. Okay, they're you committing. You have to rush it, Edward. Now joining oh, this Edward's fight, it's no, they knows it's going to break out, but not going to be able to get there oh, in time. Oh, 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 We'll win this Edward? team fight out unless Redemption? they can do something about Redemption? it. Edward? Edward trying no, to chase no, no. through from Marco. Dude. Can't catch him. Flap no. Teasy the and Ogwen is there. The turn of all turns have happened. Goats, it's just bro. Agent Zero left. The it's hell? a 4v1. Run, Edward, run. With his Benedetto, the minion wave delaying the clearing. He's holding on for dear life. And let's Agent done? Is it done? Zero. Chat, is it done? Is it over? Oh, this is too uh, close to cut it. No! Oh. 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 We are past yes. it, Doc Timers, folks. Oh, no, no and way. with that, the waves what are the looking fuck? lethal. Top Not and the mid. We got a pause, man. Escorting bang, what bang, could bang. be the final salvo of a push, a siege for tonight's championship. Oh, man. Season 12 is merely moments away. There's no better Can way to end it with a pause. But with delay. A with a pause, Can bro. they come back in time? Wow. Oh my what god. What AP Bren did there. Flap. The Filipino. Now it's replay time, bro. What the fuck? That team fight was. Left! Bro. It's oh, the Gwen and time. Flap. Oh, now, Flap. Now, this fight, it's no. They know it's going to break out, but not going to be able to get there. He in got time. three of the carries. Sensui, Ohev, and Hachi. That could not have been better for AP Bren. That is literally the best case scenario, bro. There's the oh, final oh, oh, my god. Edward's into the pool. They go. Haji gonna fall. Edward now finally a part of the fight. Oh, what Bees the heck, are outnumbered dude? by the agents. One to five wow. here in EVM. But all the more, that's why it's important for the agents to show up, make some noise, and give support to their team because they need it right at this very moment. This is going this to is the real be PH. <laughs> possibly a uh, final that defense. That set was crazy, man. And if you looked at the timers before we took this little break, 
this breather. I'm not sure if they'll I, be able to be full force. I don't think they can defend. So there's, can they defend, dude? If they defend, that really up to this game will, Edward can will delay be legendary, bro. The if Black was defend, because, it's going to be a legendary game. You know, AP Pren is pretty much, they have it in sight. That's what they're after. They can smell it. This could be the end of the season. Could be the end of the series. Our potential last look. Let's see, let's guys. Crowd. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. Well, Evolve Lord mid lane. It's over. The only one left. It's over. About 10 seconds well, until the next do? member, Haji. They should seconds. be up in time. Haji. Edwards gonna buy as much time as he can. Oh my god, Edwards. Clears the wave. No, oh, over. Oh, oh, it's oh. down. Oh. AP Bren from World Tour to Home Tour. AP Bren does it. Tonight they are champions in home soil. Mere bless in the chat, boys. Mere bless. Mere bless, boys. Season 12 champions. The curse is gone. Promise Mere bless finally era. fulfilled. Sweeter than honey on is the on victory AP long desired. The beast are now Whoa. the best. Whoa. This winning Whoa. order brought to you by our official sponsor, Whoa. FWD Life Insurance. All right, guys. Are you ready? Let's do it. Go to the English stream, guys. All right, everybody go to the English stream. Are you ready? As I'll give you some time. Go to the English stream, MLBB channel, English stream. We're going to spam woo, all right? Man, we're going to spam woo in the chat. Are you guys ready? And on the count of three, we're going to spam These guys woo have together, had okay? I'm going to wait for you guys. Year, I'm going to wait. Season, we'll wait. It's about, we're going to be, we're going to spam woo, okay, okay guys? Woo spam, woo spam. Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Talk all right. On the count of three. One, two, three. Boom. performance. We're going to go woo. By the bees. A surprise initiation to end them all. What a run for the year of triumph for this roster, for this squad. Let's go. We're taking over the chat, bro. Two of their grand finals You have been sending too many messages. Fuck you. I don't care. Top tier. Black International put it all on the line. They have nothing back. They called the KDA machine out of the dugout. And they put on quite a show. But tonight, there you go. The Wu spam, boys. We got it. Woo. Man. Uh, again, we'll still see these AP guys battling champs, out boys. ahead of us. M5. And then you got Coach Ducky here. What a most, night. What a night. What a night. The new uh, Hall Mere of bless, Legend. boys. Amazing. Multi-time MPL champion now. Under the formerly known as Brenny Sports. Now under AP Bren. One of the most impactful movements of the season here. Jinsui going to Blacklist International kept their hopes alive. You see, not only Blacklist International, but this shows the unity of our Filipino representatives for M5. Bren, AP Bren, AP comforting Bren. Sensui as well. Folks, boys, gentlemen, I can feel it. We're in good hands for M5. We're going to defend the GG. PH era, and it's these two teams on stage. These two teams at the forefront, the vanguards of greatness. Man, again, just looking even at the rise through the regular season, the triumphs, the tribulations that Blacklist International themselves the went through. Wait, guys, I'm posting a on Facebook. A lot of doubters, AB of Bread course, they still have a ton of agents Because it wasn't there, a curse, was a it was a blessing, bro. Talking about them constantly. Both, uh, both the videos that I made with the predictions, I got the champions. Again. Let's go. That speaks volumes, and it, they have plenty of time to recalibrate, refine things God again. Damn, I'm Chad. sure some people will be wondering about, you know, Haji, Yue, all these things. But at the end of the day, you can all say this was a great. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Let's check the prediction. Let's check my prediction. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Amazing teams and so much history. Fuck! Here. I don't want an like ad. No, said, I'm sorry. I don't hands. want to give myself money. No. Move fast. Be taking their final bow here. So close. Boom. To AP Brand champion prediction. So far. They this part was wrong. This whole part was wrong. But we AB Brent champion prediction. But they showed us a Brent champion got. prediction. They'll be coming back stronger in the M5 World Champ. AB Brent champ prediction. The world watches. I wonder how they'll go. All right. For Blacklist send off. Blacklist send off. Everybody shut the fuck up. It's never really over for a championship team. It's never really W Blacklist, over. man. EVM they did well. They did so good. EVM they proved Avengers everyone wrong. Knows what Blacklist put on the stage. Let's go to Mount Aquino with AP Bren. It's time for the interview. Truly remarkable. And now, your MPL Philippines Season 12 Grand. Well, what? Everybody give a big round of applause to AP Bren. 
W men. To award Ooh. the medals, Marco let's Wu. call on Mr. Nelvin Muva, first vice president and group head of Go To Market and Subs Management at Smart Communications Incorporated. AP Bren, three-time MPL Philippines Grand Finalist as Bren Esports, MPL Philippines Season 6 Grand Champion as Bren Esports, and M2 World Champion as oh, Bren MVP? Esports. Oh, Gwen or Flap, guys? Who do you guys think is Super FMVP? Marco. Oh, Gwen or Flap? Bando. Or or maybe Super I Marco don't or know the few. Kids. few. Oh, Gwen. I think the a lot of people. I think Ogwen or, or Flap, Hall right? Hall of Legends inductee, Coach Ducky. Vote, guys. Vote. Wait, wait. Vote in the vote in the in the polls, guys. Vote. Who do you guys think is MVP? Coach Red. FMVP Ogwen or Flap Tz, guys. Flap deserves it too, man. Flap did really well. Master Ogwen. <laughs> Kyle Tz. Flap. And let's give a moment for the media to take the photo op. All the time spent in practice, all sacrifices made, all days spent working hard have finally paid off. You guys bro, are hailed as the strongest mean, players, teams, <laughs> coaches, and management in the strongest MLBB region. Congratulations to the team, man. Uh, w team. They won. Sheesh. And now to announce the, finals the grand MVP. finals MVP. Let me hear it from you guys. Flapper Olguin. I'll be happy with Flapper Olguin. Congratulations to Flapper W Mr. Flap, bro. Nuba, w Flap. Flap Teasy Flap. has undeniably shown his mastery throughout the best of seven grand final series. Damn. His unmatched macro and micro mechanical skills, amazing hero mastery, and professional mentality propelled his team G -G 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 -G. towards securing a championship title. <laughs> He's so confused. He's like, wait. And now for the is it the trophy? <laughs> with the grand finals MVP. He was flap teasy, and on 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 phobias, he was tap teasy, sir. Dude, it's the twins, you're right. The FMVPs are the twins. It's Keyboy and Flap. Flap and Thank Keyboy, you, the twins, Mr. bro. Melvin Nubla. Oh my god, you're right. And now <laughs> the two ball twins. Bro. I'd like to take Keyboy this moment Flap. to oh interview you. You're our right. Grand you're right. champion. Oh my First god. of all, Flap, ikaw ang ating grand finals MVP. Flap and Keyboy, ka? the two. I'm gonna put all of them. I'm gonna put all of them. Because I'm gonna put all of them. Because they're all of them. What did he say? What did he say? Translate, translate, translate. What is Keyboy saying? Um, kay Kuya Pio po, kasi siya po yung ano eh, yung dahilan kung bakit ganun yung laro ko kanina eh. Pio, ikaw naman, kailangan natin ng representative para sa AP brand. Kayo, ang kampiyon ngayong Grand Finals ng MPL Philippines Season 12. Pio surprised he won? Did he feel? Oh. I didn't expect Pio. I thought all went on a flap. Ah, mayan, sobrang saya na ano. Nakakawa ulit ako ng championship. Tapos, Nabigyan din ng ano ng championship yung mga kampi ko na ano matagal na namin inaabol to eh. Someone translate please. Ay si Coach Brent pala gusto magsalita? Hindi po. Sab sabi ni Coach, sabi ni Coach Ducky. Hey, Brent. Uh, ano yun? Uh, nagpapasalamat ako unang una kay Boss Jab sa pagtitiwala sa akin, kay Ducky, at sa lahat ng bakit ng Brent Esports. Alam niyo naman nagsimula tayo sa sobrang hirap. Ginapang natin lahat. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you sa inyo. 
Um, gusto ko Cute magpasalamat time. sa mga Free pumunta sa fans dyan tsaka sa mga magulang ko. Marco, Kasi please say who. Dyan, if you don't say who, I'll be disappointed, Marco. Shout out boss Jab. Please Kung wala say po si who. boss Jab, wala po kami ngayon dito. Maraming salamat, boss Jab. Nagtiwala ka sa aming lahat. Tsaka kay boss AJ Ponce. Thank you po. Uh, nagpasalamat rin ako sa, ano, sa mga ano, nanonood ngayon. Ah... Uh, Uh, tsaka sumusuporta sa buong MPL. Yun lang. Thank you, thank you so much. Tsaka ano sa pamilya ko, pala sa girlfriend ko. Eh, Super Marco, Super Marco, do it. Woo! 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 And now, Woo! to immortalize your achievement, <laughs> this is now the time to raise your trophy. This trophy is rightfully Super yours. Marco Wu. In three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, Champs. your MPO Philippines Season 12 Grand Champion. God damn. AP Brand. Grand Esports Burmese Gold in the finals. A All of the champions as Grand Esports. M2. These teams have Red definitely won by challenges. Damn. Despite everything thrown their way, they found a way to return to the top of the MLBB stage. The bees have been buzzing throughout the year, securing gold medals from Cambodia, Saudi Arabia, Romania to bring honor to the country. Now, they are your MPL Philippines Season 12 champion. And we can rest well until the M5 World Championship knowing that the Philippine era is in their hands. AP Bren and Blacklist International Yo, will be our representative for the Ooh, for the M5 World Championship. Yes. 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 Thank you so much, minimum wage for the donation, 50 pesos. Red East versus Ruby Schools, thank you so much, man. Yo. Oh, is this M5 teaser? Wait, is this an M5 teaser? M5 teaser? Yo, it's an M5 teaser. Oh no, it's an MPL page teaser, I don't know. Oh, it is M5, it is M5, M5. M5 teaser. This is a fire teaser, bro. Bro, this is a lit teaser, honestly. Damn, this is a good teaser. Okay. Oh shit, it's Mara, what the heck? The trophy, the trophy. Philippines to host M5, we are ready. Group stage begins on December 2nd. Muli, ako si Mara Aquino nagpapaalala na sa M5 World Championship. Nang pinakamalalakas na Mobile Legends Bang Bang players sa buong mundo ay mananatiling mas pinaslakas. See you on M5, everybody, and keep it good vibes. M5, bro. Kai Sabno Pueto, that's Babero Wolf. Dan Kubangay, that's uh, Leo. Neil de Guzman is uh, Midnight Parating Libog. Renmar is uh, Renmar is Odin, and Odin is Renmar. I'm joking. Damn. Ah, mere bless, boys. Mere bless, mere bless, mere bless. Chop the roof and let the smoke clear. Right, next stop. Philippines for M5, huh? 
Oh my god, I can't wait, bro. But we got MPLI first. Next stop, MPLI. And then after that will be M5. That's gonna be fun. That's gonna be really hype, man. Oh my god. But yeah. And that's it, guys. Uh, for the stream, thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Much appreciated to every single one of you guys. I'm gonna give a shout out to everybody who donated through Social Buzz first. Uh let me just give a shout out to the people who donated through Social Buzz. Woo, thank you so much. Woo, one last woo in the chat. Woo! June Palmero, Ellie, Drago, Mirho, Retrograde, Mirho again, Cairo, Fiezal. Thank you so much for all the donations. Much appreciated. And everybody who donated through Super Chat as well. You guys are all big fucking W's, all right? So, wait, let me just give you guys a shout out as well. Let's start with the people who became members today. Shout out to Mudabushit for becoming a member six months. Uh, Ellie, thank you so much. Raiden Shogun as well. Sarek, thank you so much for rejoining the membership. Uh, we also have Dems and Shiro. Much appreciated to you guys. Ikel, SDXDL underscore fan. And for the supers, W guys, minimum wage. Thank you so much for the donation. Astro Zan, some dude as well for all the donations today. Much appreciated. And last but definitely not least, maybe the most important, every single one of you guys in the chat who's still spamming woo, who's still staying till the end of the stream. W you guys, woo you Whoa. guys. Yo, final Derime. donation Pesan. from no. May. 30 SGD. Thank you so much, May. No rank. We will try to do rank tonight or tomorrow, actually. Tomorrow is the safer choice, honestly. Tomorrow. Pro we'll, do, we'll do rank tomorrow, okay? So don't miss it. If you guys want to watch, if you guys are new here on the channel, click that subscribe button. We do rank games almost every night. And we'll try to do it daily starting from tomorrow, Monday. Okay, guys? But yeah, thank you so much. I'm going to shout out every single pe uh, person in the chat. You always say that. May, don't worry. Tomorrow, 100%. We do. We will We will 100% rank. Because tomorrow, I have nothing. Tomorrow is Monday. Nothing to do. All right? So we will rank tomorrow, 100%. Okay? Okay? Woo, woo, woo. Okay, woo. Okay. But yes, uh, we'll do rank for sure, 100% tomorrow. Okay? Do... Trust me on this. This time, is a, it's a mere bless as well, okay? Uh, shout out to the people in the chat. Cats, May, thank you so much for the last donation. ZQX, Silver, Carl, Ariel, White Rabbit, Killer Instinct. We have Setsuna, Quanta, Shiro, Foxy, MLBB, Aisha, Race 12, Tier here, Babana, Baba Babana, Banana, Anna, Espiritu, GMYT, Dean, Luden, Silver, White Rabbit, Carl, ZQX, Mars Santillan, Cats. We have uh, Vince De La Cruz, Komorebi, Aisha, again, Tier here. Uh, White Rabbit, Clacker, Say D, Richard Luktu, Gabriel Omar, Kairos, Greedy Grid, Wild Boys, Julio, Tianzi, Formixel, Darwin Vergara. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys at MPLI and then at M5. Boom bang. Oh, no, actually, see you guys tomorrow. We're not, we're not going to be going away for that long. But tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow. If you guys come over to the stream, you should rank stream at 7 p.m. GMT plus 7 as usual. Peace out. Boom bang, bada bing. Drop the roof and let the smoke clear.